Hello and welcome to the Matt Black Podcast. We're up to episode 12 and my guests today are Ash and Reach. How are we doing? Hello. Yo, yo, yo. We're oh, good. that's a lot of sound. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I've never, never had four people in here at once, so yeah. it's, uh, it's probably going to get warm. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Are we all comfortable? We're all yeah. good. Yeah. We're all good. Yeah. Was it a good trip into Barnsley? Subjective. If that's, if that's <laughs> possible. <laughs> it's actually really pretty. As it we is, got closer, yeah. but the rest of it, we were stuck in traffic on the you motorway. You need to change so your prescription, I think. <laughs> I know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it was nice, wasn't no, it? We've we nice. seen a, yeah, like, the... couple of Ferraris and a couple of like rolling Which hills. Which way did you we, go? I, was going to say, yeah. Yeah. I, I think Waze must have took us like a back way or something. <laughs> we, got, we got the posh route. Yeah, we did. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't. <laughs> <laughs> they were Holy definitely route. stolen, weren't they? So how's life? It's been a while since we've seen each other, isn't it? Yeah, man, it's been too long, if anything. Pre lockdown, wasn't it? Yeah, it was um, that that's that year that will go down in history, twenty twenty. Yeah. Yeah. So we we had a little uh, a run around the country excursion. together, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that was awesome. A mischievous excursion. <laughs> that's that's what finished everything off, I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah. As soon as we caught off tour. Well, Everyone was like, "Now nah, I've got to, everyone's got to stay in now." No, nah, that, that was we, it. Was we, too no much. Point. We, we spread our Shut filth the economy down <laughs> too far and wide. Oh. The tour was so sick. It just had to <laughs> lock down the whole country. All I think of, though, to be honest, when I think of the tour is the video of, that, of Kyle eating that bread, like a whole bread roll. <laughs> do you remember when do you remember it was in Glasgow? You know when we went to Spoons in Glasgow? Oh, yeah. And um, it was on the top floor, and we were all we were all just talking shit, to be fair, but like, Paddy secretly filmed Kyle on the sly eating bread. Eating bread in the most animalistic way you can imagine. Oh, there was a point <laughs> in your mouth. He was, nah. he was deep throating the bread. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, family guy when the train's going in the tunnel. <laughs> it's like that, but with bread and his face. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I put some less than friendly text over, <laughs> over the video. <laughs> the worst thing is, as well, that bread was mid. <laughs> it looked like you were enjoying it like <laughs> no it's just mid bread I was very hungry though so <laughs> so how is the OnlyFans account going then <laughs> you got was... one sub haven't you so far yep. <laughs> thank you mum <laughs> 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 it's pocket money the whole thing how he didn't touch the bell. <laughs> know, yeah. Please touch the bell. <laughs> oh no, I believe him, I believe him. I know. I believe him. It pays for me PlayStation <laughs> subscription, it's fine. <laughs> for anyone that's tuning in on our audio only, we have a bullshit bell on here, so uh, I, I'm, I'm not, I don't think I'm going to need yeah. it, to be honest with you. Out of context, that would have sounded pretty strange, to be fair, after you just said that, so... Yeah. <laughs> just wait till I edit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> How's the only fans? Please press the bell. <laughs> no, no one's safe from the evidence. <laughs> uh, Both been good, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, been good, yeah. To, to answer your question. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so for um, obviously people that might be tuning in, there's going to be people that obviously know all all about you, follow your band, follow your, uh, probably around the country, buy all your shit. Um, mm. But there's going to be some people that. They might be viewing you for the first time, so I think we should do like a bit of a round the room AA meeting and. Uh, yeah. yeah. That's a who wants idea. to start it off? I, I, fuck it, I'll start it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, the enthusiasm. Um, yeah, no, yeah. He's just, so happy. It's, it's on the spot, isn't it? It's on the spot. Um, yeah. So my name's Joe. I play guitar in Ash and Reach. Um, and he's so I like it. Like it's good. I like long it's walks on the gig. beach. Long walks on the beach. I like. I like, uh, I like it. It's yeah. good. <laughs> Someone sitting behind him with a gun to his head, like you like it. Don't you? What we've established is being in this band's shit. <laughs> so far. <laughs> You, no, can, um, you can talk about yourself as well. It doesn't okay, just have to be the music. That, that, that is that's about cool. That's about it, really. Guitar is where it starts and ends, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, about, I'm, I'm one dimensional aside from that, really. Um, yeah, I, I play guitar in the band. I um, also work in a music museum with guitars. Surprise, surprise. In my, in my spare time, I like to play guitar. Um, <laughs> And so you should hope he's good at it. <laughs> he only played Wonderwall. <laughs> and, my, my, really well. and, and my idea of porn hub is andertons.co.uk. So. <laughs> what do they sell? 
<laughs> you don't want to know. Oh, well, um, G strings. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, I am. <laughs> I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah, yeah. Your name. Uh, yeah, yeah. Your name. <laughs> Fucking name again. Uh, I am. Uh, so I'm Kyle. I sing in Ash and Reach, and I like it. It's yeah. good. <laughs> it's dead good, and that I get to do. I get to do shouty and singy things, and yeah, it's 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 all right. It's it's, it's, it's a bit of fun. Um, it's all right. It's, <laughs> I am. Um, I've got a few hobbies. Like I like skating, climbing, stuff like that, gaming. Um. Yeah, <laughs> I'm trying to think, you know when your mind goes blank. <laughs> yeah, and um, I'm eating bread. Pun? Yeah. Eating bread? I do, I do like eating bread. Only like good tier bread though. Yeah, okay. Mm. Like, Glizzy baguettes. I do like, I like, I'm, I'm liking the seeded Warburton's bread at the, the moment. Wheat, the oh. wheat, the wheat. Go for that yeah. protein. Yeah. Getting that seed in you. <laughs> the wheat Glizzy. <laughs> <laughs> I need all the seed at the moment for the protein. <laughs> Glizzy McGuire. <laughs> Red? You can't <laughs> see <laughs> You uncultured swine. <laughs> Straight back to OnlyFans again. Yeah. With your basic <laughs> Tesco value bread, I'm I, guessing. I just have wraps, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's all good. Fair enough, carry on. Yeah. Oh, you, go on, enter yourself. I, um... <laughs> the bar has been set yeah. very low. <laughs> well, well, Kyle's well, mum's watching well, him be well, seated. Well, oh my god. <laughs> She's well, a member of Dead Island. No, we'll not do it anymore. <laughs> the bar's been, the bar's been no. set low. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, my name's Paddy, and I'm basically these two combined because I sing and play guitar. <laughs> and do you like it? It's all right. <laughs> Sometimes people come up to me and go, oh, I really like that bit where Kyle sings in a slightly different tone yeah, on that new track. It's like, that's fucking me, you plonker. <laughs> <laughs> that's probably the best bit. <laughs> it's when someone was like, we had a review, and they oh. were like, oh, you can tell um, there's um, there's back, there's like pre-recorded vocals, because there's a bit where Kyle's not singing, and there's still vocals going. It's like, yeah. Paddy, <laughs> you too. Pa- just look slightly to the left. Turn of your head thirteen <laughs> degrees, <laughs> and you'll see where that rogue voice is coming from. <laughs> so it's actually wild. <laughs> Plot twist: He doesn't sing. I'm just a ventriloquist. <laughs> <laughs> I also have hobbies. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why it's just so much better in your accent. <laughs> I, I also have hobbies. I too enjoy other things. Apart, apart, sure? from, apart, from, apart from this fucking shit. <laughs> I've only had half a can. <laughs> I had a burger before this, so it's not that. I'm going to just instantly do right. It's Kyle making you say it, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> He's got his hand up, yeah. <laughs> He's playing that. Um, Again, holy fans. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of the top tier videos. <laughs> Uh, Serious question: Is that how it works? Is it in like tears? I, I, I wouldn't know to be honest. Oh, right. I don't actually have an OnlyFans. <laughs> it, yeah, that is. No, yeah. <laughs> <for this. laughs> Defo. Lots of them. Lots of them. Extra money. Private DM requests. <laughs> you can pay extra to send a private DM. <laughs> Oh. Make, making bread with his feet. Uh, <laughs> Just rolling the dough. Oh, that's disgusting. I pay money to not see yeah. that. <laughs> I've not washed in months, so it's extra oh. yeasty. Oh. Oh, You've been rubbing it on your bum. <laughs> <laughs> Sour and oh. oh my god. <laughs> <sighs> I'm not sending any of this podcast to me family. <laughs> Mine's here, so it's all right. Is <laughs> <laughs> that all you like? I'm Paddy, and I'm a recovering uh, alcoholic, <laughs> depressive beast. 
What the hell? <laughs> the, beast, the beast of uh, where, where, Barnsley. Oh, Barnsley. Bar- <laughs> <laughs> Please, yeah. Jess. Save the best till last. <laughs> Save us all. My name's Jess. I'm the drummer for Ash and Reach. I think he's singing. Even though you get asked every gig if, oh, well, here's your mic, and I was like, get it away from me. I uh, have my own tattoo studio. And the studio. microphone. Yeah, literally. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, true. I go, I have a music scene in it. I've got my own tattoo studio called Evil Toad Tats. Paddy also works over me. And I like to play games and stream on Twitch as well. And then I don't do anything else, don't go outside or nothing. (laughs) (laughs) And I like it. I like it. (laughs) Oh, it's all right. Most of the time, I like it. I like my room. (laughs) Yeah. Although not in this weather, it's very disgusting right now in this weather. It's just... I've got a big massive green screen because I use my dad's, but our room is like... One meter by one meter, and as soon as I put it up, I have to put it behind me, like behind me back and between me chair, and it cuts the one meter in half. Oh, no. And then my PC's there, and the windows are open, and it's just like Smothering. absolutely boring with yeah, sweat. Yeah. It's horrid at the moment. <coughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's see what's going on on Twitch. Why is there just some greasy? Woman Literally, why is there, why is there a shiny egg on the screen? <laughs> She's got it. dough in her hair. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> I thought this was Twitch, to be honest. Some of the stuff on Twitch these days. The jacuzzi videos Hot tub or whatever. Streams, yeah. like yeah. That's what we've got to all start doing to get some money, Hot mate. Stream. <laughs> yeah, it's like half the stuff on Twitch, isn't it? Oh, people know, playing games. Know, it's literally. <laughs> Just e girls getting their fucking gap out. <laughs> I was actually, I was, saying to Kyle, gap. I was saying to Kyle on the way down, I'm thinking about starting a Twitch account. Yeah, that's. Uh... You can't even use your phone. <laughs> <laughs> and you think I'm lying? <laughs> Notice how the bullshit bell has not been broken. <laughs> there's, there's, there's a major line of dust on this thing. <laughs> we, only, we only speak truths. Factual information. See the Twitch thing, that's I think I'm maybe just slightly too old and boring. So I don't I don't really know. I think it's just it's just a streaming site, isn't it? It's just streaming, yeah, streaming yeah, video games, yeah. chatting, art. Is it only for video games then? No, no, no. Because no, 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 no. oh, that's the probably the bit that puts but me off. I think there is, like, you, you can set where you pick um, what you're doing. So you either type in a game or you can type just chatting or art and it, like, categorises it all so people can search for people what they like. There is, a, there a, is a Twitch one. category called uh, Just Hot Tubs, Pools, and oh, Saunas. Or something. Yeah, there is. Like, yeah. What was the mukbang one? You he see? searches it all the yeah. time. <laughs> Literally, it's full of soggy Literally. bread. And also, most people you see on Twitch are quite boring, and this is entertaining. So, like, <laughs> you're very right. Get on the Twitch. <laughs> But yeah, like it's it's the what world. Was, so. What was the one you seen that you told me about? Where it was like they, they came to take my kids away, muck bank. What? <laughs> what? That what was, was that one? I think it was just a meme. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was like a stream that you'd seen or something. Ah, uh, some guy like crying, like eating bread, like Kyle in spoons, crying, and the title was like, "Please don't take my kids, muck bank." <laughs> Oh, what is a mukbang? It's when people just like food? people just eat sh- like shit loads of food like in one sitting. Like they'll just buy loads of food and they'll just like they'll eat it all. Just talk and eat. They'll usually, talk usually talk they have the mic settings so you can hear everything. Uh, 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 yeah. I would say that brother. Uh. Like, yeah. like, like, like people eating ASMR. Uh, yeah. yeah, like that. I hate them ASMR Paddy videos. Paddy does that into my ear when I'm just standing there and it's disgusting. It's going to strangle him. Like just. Yeah, it's, cool. it's like. I'll be, be scrolling through TikTok and you've got them like, there'll be like bubble wrap on the microphone, they're just like tapping on it, and I'm just like, oh, don't just come I on. like the Spider Man one where he's got a spider mask on and he's just screaming into the mic and like smacking it with like a cheese grater and stuff. Not, not even it's seen, ASMR. Like, what, what was it? It's like, Bugatti. It's like, Bugatti. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's yeah. for people that's talentless then basically that yeah basically <laughs> those ones usually I'm just going to make things crackle and move and yeah, yeah they yeah. just wh- and then they whisper or they don't talk they just kind of go like, and you go like what are you doing like what and then but then there's people just sat there going yeah slay and you're just like what the hell is going on 
you sound I'm really Kyle. old I'm when you said that then. <laughs> my name's Kyle. One of my hobbies is verbally abusing ASM artists. <laughs> it's not a real job. You talentless pigs. <laughs> Stop sloping hey, in the ear. they have to grow their nails long or stick them on just to go. That's not. Uh, that's not a talent. <laughs> that is not a talent. No, you just jealous be, you that they get. It is if you ain't got any fingers. Fair enough, Mario. There's people scrolling through TikTok with a nose. It's like. <laughs> the the S and ASMR stands for stump. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I keep seeing all of the Indian guys, and they're just sitting in a puddle, like in a no, car. That is that is the thing at the moment. <laughs> what just a bunch of dudes? Yeah, I'm like they're live, it's but they're two guys. Like there's like one guy there. up to his eyes in the puddle, and then there's a guy like sat in, in a fishing puddle, chair, like puddle. behind him. And they just don't do it. Like, I have seen that. Is this about, supposed to be about music, by the way? No, it's not at all. <laughs> yeah, I've seen it. Like honestly, you just see them. They're just sat there, just like chilling in the water, and I'm like, they definitely full of bugs. Yeah, they <laughs> they definitely full of bugs. Where's England? There's a T-shirt. Tired, yeah, they full of bugs. That Merch works. coming out soon. <laughs> They definitely <laughs> full of bugs. TM copyright. <laughs> <laughs> like anyone's Joe's going to be designing the t-shirt right now as you speak. Oh, that's a good idea, that. <laughs> they definitely full of bugs. I you just missed the error there. I actually feel bad because like, I've seen some clips of the podcast on Instagram and I've seen some like people talking about some very like serious <laughs> matters. We're saying the S and A So you thought you'd follow suit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're in so awareness about the bullshit yeah. of ASMR. Gonna go viral for all Don't the wrong reasons. Don't forget to mention the Indian guys. <laughs> Full of bugs. To be fair though, I, I I was sat for a good ten minutes watching them going, "What's gonna happen? Nothing like happens. Not they happen. don't move." But I was sat there. There was another one. Are like... sure they're alive? No, it's it's face down. It's probably it's the guy just in the water watching two yeah. corpses. No, no, he means like a replay he's, of like a same ten minute video. Oh right, <laughs> he spent ten minutes waiting for a JPEG to move. <laughs> <laughs> There was one though I did They're see. So still, and I watched it for twenty odd minutes. It's a fucking bitch. No, no, it was this. ASMR. It was this. Oh my god! It was this dude in an ice cream truck, and he's just driving, and but like his like you know like the card reader, it's like just on the side of the window nearly and the window's open and he's proper bombing it round and they're going he's gonna lose his like he's gonna lose his card reader and all the comments are like bro you card reader you card reader and i was watching it for about 20 minutes till i realized i think that's like glued on that's not gonna move that that's but really i was still that, in case one person was gonna rob it i was like oh, i feel like what? i've slipped into another dimension <laughs> what are you talking about watch the ice cream guy with <laughs> welcome to yorkshire <laughs> where i should be <laughs> stupid guys sorry <laughs> What you do in your spare time? Watch a guy drive an ice cream truck and pray that his card reader doesn't fall out. That's the, the most the boring story ever. It was dead good though. Watch yeah, it. it's not as boring. Yeah, it's so yeah save, save that one for band documentary. <laughs> yeah. I like I to don't shoot all the good out. stuff now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> There's money in that. You'll be watching. You'll, it'll come up now because you know phones listen and whatnot. Oh, yeah. you, like, and you'll be like, "Oh yeah, shit, bro. this is that ice cream dude that Kyle yeah. was on about." I'm not gonna watch it. It's only been 20 minutes and I dread to think what my news feed's going to be like. <laughs> <laughs> Just give it a week before you look at it again. Mukbang puddles and ice cream in, in, in Indian ice cream bug mukbang. <laughs> That's a funny shape, yeah. Warburton's. <laughs> <laughs> well, we got the hellos out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, yeah. We Shit, that's just yeah. Start. That was the yeah. intros. <laughs> You've learned a lot about us. Yeah. Don't know why I'm looking into the, like as if that's the camera. <laughs> Hi guys. Hello. <laughs> so. <laughs> I am very tired. It's been a long week. Oh. It's only drinking Fanta as well. <laughs> right. So. <laughs> How would you follow that? So yeah. Um, obviously, last time I saw you, uh, I don't know if it's a touchy subject or not, but there used to be five of you. What's what? what's what's gone on? I don't mean at the beginning of the, the hellos. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Wait, who? <laughs> no, no, yeah. One's got bored. Pissed yeah. off. 
done. Yeah, so what, you've dropped down from a five-piece to a four-piece. Tell me about it. Um, it was... And this can be edited afterwards. That's a juicy, <laughs> that's a juicy question, that, bro. No, 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 no. For, for, yeah. ba- basically, um... It's not us, it's you. Yeah. It's not us, it's you. Yeah. No, yeah. That, that's crazy. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't working. Oh, just say stuff without it, like, sounding yeah, horrid. You don't want it to sound, you don't want it to sound bitchy or anything, truth. but it is the truth. You know? It wasn't yeah, working. Well, these things it happen, this is yeah. gel. Bam, it, isn't it? And he didn't know any of the new songs, even though he was supposed to be there. And I, th- I think, honestly, what... What one one thing that um, you kind of realise is you know if you release if you release an album three years ago and you've been playing one of the songs of that album wrong without realising that you've been playing it wrong and you've written the bass line for it kind of is a bit of a red flag you know I'm just just keeping it one hundred but you know that is what it that yeah. for me that was one of the the oh shit wake up kind of catalysts at least um, yeah. at a gig because I would. Always live, and like, there's a certain part of the riff that just sounds a bit bummed out, and it turns out it's because please don't be there me. was a please riff not be being played. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I've got an ever tune, it can't be me. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's <laughs> the get out of jail <laughs> card. But, like, but, but yeah, like, you know, it, that ended up being the reason for why it sounded that way anyway, and yeah. among other things, but yeah, um, <clears throat> it just... It just wasn't working out in the end, and I think better for him, better for us, you know. Yeah. Um, Ro- These things Ro- happen in bands all the time. Ro- Roland's yeah. great, and you know he's he's a great guy. You know he's Roland. always on time. This um, is our sample pad now that yeah. he's saying is a great guy. <laughs> yeah. Ro- Roland's amazing. He's he 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 knows he knows what he needs to do. He does. I've it. never heard him get anything wrong. Yeah. Once. <laughs> Yeah. When the click came out of the speakers. Yeah, that, that was, that was input fault. error, that wasn't his fault. That wasn't, that wasn't Rolly's fault. <laughs> See, I wanted to ask you about that, because obviously, yeah, you've got Roland doing mm-hmm. that. Uh, yeah. is, that a, is that a permanent fixture then? Or? That, was remember, yeah. that was something we were wanting to do anyway, because we wanted to expand the sound. Yeah, not um, with the bass like as in like yeah. the same yeah, yeah, yeah. Where there goes one half day, parts and then just go like <laughs> one that. day we will sack whoever's playing bass, <laughs> yeah. no matter how good he is. <laughs> Mr. Sheehan, off you fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it, it was more for, like, why, Welcome, why? Roland. <laughs> why, why are we paying him when we could just save room buy in the that? van? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We were like, if we fuck him off, we can go in two cars instead <laughs> of the <laughs> It was a logistical decision. <laughs> Regardless of the five or four piece, though, we just wanted like yeah. to have the orchestral parts in some yeah. of the songs. And, and, like, and he's like, yeah, since that we can't do live, because... We don't have an orchestra. Because you are not an orchestra, yeah. yeah. Exactly. So is, uh, we, w- we that was going to be there regardless, and just to keep things tighter as well to start playing to an actual click. Because yeah. before that, we were raw dogging it. Yeah, we were. Yeah. Oh yeah. So and even though it's fine, obviously, just keeping everything more consistent and it's better for time and for shows and everything. And it's just it's more professional. Yeah, yeah. Right. we've Next gone down. We've gone down the same route. We click some synthy bits because. Yeah. No one is, uh, no one stands still on stage to play synth. No. Yeah, to probably fall over. So we didn't sack the bass player though. We've kept him. So he's quite, he's quite funny. So. He's a legend, Josh. Oh, dude, yeah. he, he's a, Josh is a fucking legend. Man. He, he's listening to this, Josh. Love you, man. Oh. Him. <laughs> it's also impossible to make playing a keyboard look cool. Yeah, like it's I mean, is, yeah, incorrect. True. There was a band called The Defiled, and um, the synth player had it, and he would literally throw it in the air, like like wrap it all around him and stuff like that, and he'd be spinning it around so his arm. Just and that. Yeah. yeah, but it looked sick as fuck. He's essentially like a majorette with a keyboard. It was all yeah, and it, it was wasn't boss. even plugged in. He's yeah. just got it all unplugged and spinning it. It was. Around. I just remember watching it, like seeing it live, and I was just like, "That's wild." <laughs> Like, how do you even the do AVD, that? The AVD, wasn't that his name? What? The AVD. The David. Defiled, the guy, the guy from the, yeah. I can't remember. David, the guy, the the guy, the guy from the Defiled who played keys, I think he was called the AVD. Yeah, I don't know what you mean, though. It's sick. Yeah, it was, that's yeah. the only time I've ever gone, that's a cool as fuck synth player. It's almost No, impossible. No disrespect to synth players, because, you know, they, they sound sick. Yeah. But, like, he, like, start flipping them. Like, he was fully flipping, like, them. flipping like, them. I like, flipping them off, then. Start flipping them. Just, just. 
spin them round. Like, <laughs> All your expensive gear. Just yeah, just the guy, from, the guy from Sticks does that. He's got it on a pole and he spins it around. Oh, and right. then he stands on it and stamps on it and all sorts That's of shit. Nice. I the only like thing I... he doesn't do is fuck it by the sound. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like does I'm... all that. Like, what the fuck? I could stand well, I like, like, yeah. That key's key stuck down. There's some sourdough between them. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, sometimes like trying to just play the song and headbang at the same time can be problematic. I so can't even trying to do smile fucking backflips and <laughs> setting stuff on fire and stuff. I, that's too many things to think People about. People would ask me if I was having fun at gigs because it only took me until more recently to like be able to like change Emote. my facial expressions <laughs> while playing the drums because I'd be concentrating so hard that it's just like Bro, hit the forbidden you know. emos. <laughs> yeah. Smile. It's like, I am having fun. Just... How dare you not smile on stage? It's cringe, isn't it? You know, you've got to yeah. keep up the facade. Yeah, I just... Have a loving <laughs> life and... I don't know. Resting, I don't know of what, like... Resting keep drum up. face. Yeah. <laughs> After a week of stabbing people with a needle. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, literally. <laughs> and then going to work. I'm quite a happy person, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I should have worn a long sleeve. I know. <laughs> Don't hit me. No. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> okay, hell. I have stabbed him a couple of times then. Have you seen me flinch? Oh, is, this, is this your work? That yeah, one is. Yeah, so Josh thing. has got one of those, like a pixelated pixel. kind of uh, thing, yeah. It was cool. It was the first pixel one I did. And I was like, mint. I need to get a tattoo. I'm the only one with virgin skin in this band. Yeah, but now. Kyle's only got a stick, man, really. It's not that much. Um, He's also got a hat on and a skateboard. <laughs> a hat. Yeah, that's yeah. no regular stick, man, that is. Yeah. That's an that is, it's a, he's six, an advanced one. I think he said he's six foot. He's yeah, sick that, as fuck. Yeah. He's six foot. That's a six foot tattoo. Ring, ring the bell. <laughs> 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 I've seen his tattoo. My tattoo is was, six foot. He was twitching. <laughs> <laughs> he was I love it like, when everyone, like, like, everyone comes over from Merseyside and can't even understand each other. I know, yeah. <laughs> Are you Merseyside? Did you say you're Merseyside? I'm Cheshire. Is it? Oh, yeah. I'm Cheshire, does, but they're trying. The they're trying to make it Merseyside. Like, we've got Mersey, like, Mersey travel Mersey logos. With all, the, yeah. with all yeah. the plastic accents they've been trying for a long time. Yeah, they have, to be mm. fair. Ron Cohn's full of them. Cringe lords. Yeah, and you've got yeah. witness full of, like, plastic manks. Yeah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I, 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 I'm mad for it, mad for it. I'm not, I'm just, I'm just chilling, Joe, does, Joe doesn't look mad for it. <laughs> <laughs> He's chilling, bro. Just, just big chilling. chilling. Big chilling. Big chilling. Big chilling. Big Willie Styley. <laughs> Will Smith, not not. <laughs> He's there, like, just going. I just sit hung. <laughs> <laughs> There's an edit of that, you know, where it's like Jaden Smith when he was like six doing an award presentation. Yeah, I've seen. It's like, my, my dad lied to me about the film. It's like, keep my fucking name out your goddamn mouth. I've seen it's funny. Dude, that was, that was cringe. Mm. See, that's that's all going to fall into that kind of category of his lies where we've just lost it all, haven't we? Well, there's, there's been a, a lot has happened since... We went on road together oh, yeah. to yeah. this point right now. Yeah. There's been some stuff, epic dude. moments. <laughs> it feels like a, like a fever dream. You're like oh, thinking cool. about things. You're like, did that actually happen? And you have to like YouTube or Google it. Yeah. And you're like, oh yeah, it did. Like Will Smith raps for twenty odd years without swearing, and then decides to beat someone up and swear, <laughs> yeah. and then swear his on head live, TV. live telly, <laughs> and then gets an award. <laughs> yeah. That was crazy, totally dude. He literally came out the ne- the same night crying. And didn't even apologise. That was wild. <laughs> you see, if like, he won an award, if you, that's why you, you went to work though, and you crack somebody, they're not just gonna kind of go, "Oh yeah, we'll still give him that employer the month at the end of the day." Yeah. <laughs> 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 well done, well done. <laughs> Some guy with a clipboard. Well, that actually happened after the third. So uh, well, we're, we're, we're into next month now. Well, then you, you <laughs> so he's not disqualified, actually. <laughs> Someone saying it like the hawk to woman hasn't she just been fired from her job? See, I don't think she, that's true because there's a lot of mad stories going on about that. Yeah, because yeah, like, I, I read that she's not. She's she not deleted not. all her socials and stuff. I yeah. think, and like she's kind of gone off grid. I think maybe people are just like bugging her that much. Which it's is funny. What a legend! Yeah, yeah. she's just a queen, man. <laughs> just drops like the meme of the year. Yeah. Casually, she's <laughs> been sacked. That's a tragedy. Because that's wild, though, and it? it's like you know. 
it was, it's, it's funny as fuck, but it literally could have ruined the life completely. Nah, like, it's nah, a joke. That's like I, I, it, it shouldn't go that far. Like it's it's just fucking funny. She didn't yeah. even say anything like. No, you know, just, it was just funny. It wasn't like out of... I mean, it was out of pocket, but it wasn't like offensive or... Like, yeah, it was just no, hilarious. It was Maybe Christian moms against Hacktur <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. like, yeah. were like bummed out by it. But like normal yeah. people probably thought, oh, that was dead funny. Yeah. They go with like... They're just proper the kicking The Hacktur Baptist Church. <laughs> <laughs> Praise the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Bitten on them for Christmas. Oh, Bit on that thing. No. Oh. <laughs> Did you say for christening? Yeah. That's horrible. Just baptising them on the floor. No. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't eat the bread on a Sunday there. <laughs> Just flicking chunks of sourdough off the floor. No. That, that stuff does happen though. It's like, I'm, I'm not going to mention, but somebody I worked with ended up going viral on. It got yeah. picked up by a lad Bible, and then it went on everything like oh, really? millions and millions of views doing something, and uh, and and she ended up and well, she ended up walking from oh. the, the workplace oh, really? before because they were kind of already calling it in, saying like, "We need to talk to you about this." Yeah, so she yeah. was like, "You know what? Before you do, I quit." Was yeah. it, was yeah. it like? Was it like- NSFW was like racist or what? Like, oh no, it weren't. It weren't. Racism is like safe for work, apparently. Oh, no. <laughs> well, you know what I mean. Like, that, that is right. The place that where you work. NSFW applies something else, and it's not racism. What like, gets said on site stays on site. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Like what? What are you not allowed to like say? Or like, what was it? Like what was the? Yeah, just something rude. Yeah, but, <laughs> yeah. Hot to yeah, we're in that kind of category, yeah. Yeah. but he's, doing something. He's yeah. MDA'd out of his mind. <laughs> <laughs> was it was it four years ago or less? <laughs> give, us a, give us a show in six months. months. <laughs> <laughs> give us a show in six months. Put, put it in the calendar. We'll be back. We'll be back for the next podcast when the NDA's out. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You'd be like, yeah, that, that, coming that, back. That's great, that man. I, I don't know, dude. Like. It's like you can't. It's illegal to have a sense of humour now. Yeah, yeah. Like, I was gonna say, like, you know, that if that reason that girls like deleted all the shit offline and stuff is just like crazy. Like, it, it shouldn't have to come to that. Like, yeah. people should just learn to take a joke. She never said anything offensive. They're probably yeah. going to people just asking her to spit on that thing. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, I mean, yeah. yeah. You know, she, like, she gets called into the office and she's like, "Oh, I'm getting sacked." Then her boss is like. She's spit on that thing, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Everybody said, though, it's like she could literally quit work tomorrow if she set up an OnlyFans. Yeah, yeah. Because bro. she's got the exposure now. If she yeah, t- yeah. Like, if she TM, everyone's going to come to it. If she TM'd that phrase and whacked it on a shirt, she wouldn't need to work again, bro. <laughs> At the moment, for real, like, she wouldn't need to work again. <laughs> She'd that, free, she cash in on that merch. Yeah. I think, I think yeah. I've think seen somewhere, like, uh, the, some um, some company in America has actually, like, Try to get a hold of it to collab on like caps, you know, trucker caps. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's hot too on it because let's be honest, they're the only people you're gonna sell them to. You know? uh, I mean, like, no way. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, it would buy a hawk tur merch. <laughs> Jesus, like. Yeah, he just bought a shirt. <laughs> it came up on Amazon going, we think you might like this, and it was a t-shirt, and it's like the Run DMC style logo, but it just says hawk tour spit on that thing, and I was like, yes. So I bought it. It was thirteen quid, yeah. and I wore the best. Did you actually buy it? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, you had it on last yeah, time. I mean, yeah, it's um, if you look at the picture when I'm with a uh, nice Peter Epic Lloyd <coughs> when I went to see Epic Rap Battles. Well, that's it. Um, I'm literally wearing it because that's what he like. Like <laughs> Epic Lloyd's Stay. pointing at it because he's just like, dude, when did you get that T-shirt? And I was like, the other it's like day. <laughs> This meme came out an hour ago. Like, <laughs> I, oh, how, 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 you, how have you got a t shirt? Just a white shirt with Sharpie on it. Just hot to and Sharpie. I got so many compliments yesterday for that t shirt alone. It was brilliant. And I, mean, then, I always like the idea of like getting stuff like that and then looking after it until you're really old. And then. <laughs> 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 and, then, and then when you're like 85, Tell you're in the Asda, you bring, yeah. you bring walking down, walking down fruit and veg aisle. Just <laughs> hock to her t-shirt. Just all the pensioners going, oh, that takes me back. <laughs> <laughs> Spit on that thing. <laughs> Spit on me. that thing. <laughs> <laughs> just walking, thinking of all the other memes, just like a succulent Chinese meal. <laughs> I was, th- I was t- in my head. I had it with more like reverence, you know, like bringing it down to the front room, the grandkids, yeah. the, a- the ancient text. <laughs> like, this was me. Like bringing it, bringing it down with gloves on, like 
What's a hawk to a <laughs> Sit down and let me tell you a tale. <laughs> Now, uh, now, for legal reasons, I can't show you. <laughs> <laughs> but, I'll do, but I'll do my best to explain it. <laughs> Excuse me, I don't mean to be rude. <laughs> 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 Look at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow. <laughs> You're going to have to ask us like three the, questions, Tom. Yeah, isn't is this the most unhinged podcast yet? Uh, yeah, but for good reasons. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, it always happens. Any like interview we had, like yeah, we had one with. Um, what was the last one we did? Oh, Twisted, right. torn, and moist, and they yeah, asked yeah. us a couple of questions, and they were like, "How many um, bones are in the adult human body?" And Paddy's just like, "One more if you get in the van." <laughs> <laughs> I used to play golf. If someone's sticking a tee down like that, yeah. I'm fucking swinging. <laughs> you you hesitated first, though, so he was like, I've got a really funny answer for that one. You have to question everything now. The, 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 the spontaneity of humour is gone. You have to, like, literally think, on am, I go- am I going to be able to... Go out in public after this. Like, is this gonna go viral? Am I getting cancelled? Hopefully, hopefully not. I haven't Four even hour podcast haven't even... with ten minutes of usable content. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even, I haven't even made it yet to get cancelled, and it's already over. Like, and then you sometimes you gotta send it, dude. Yeah, nice double down. Spit on that thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're past the LOs now. Aren't we? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Just about. Nice to meet you. We've done. Oh, have a You've done all right. The evening about thirty-eight minutes. Thirty-eight the... minutes of utter nonsense. Bro, all the yappuccino. Yeah. Have you got one? <laughs> it's all, it's all, it's cool because the card will take about fifty hours. Oh, right. oh we've got yeah. time. Yeah, yeah. So it says. Oh, yeah. Sad. Oh. Cameras will do four. Oh, so okay. <laughs> definitely gonna be five. dark when you leave it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just said Josie for it, so. <laughs> You've got a basement, basement level to this, then, or something. So. No, I, 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 I keep always like saying like, oh, because I'd, I'd just built it so it would just, just within the restrictions of planning permission. Yeah. So, uh, but then I'm like, oh, I'd love, I'd love to just go up a level. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just, just have a, a bridge across to my bedroom as soon as I've finished. Don't even have to walk out yeah. to the garden. Straight just out. To go, whoop. Yeah. Get a zip line to come down. I never uh, want to experience line. fresh air again. Up. Yeah, but you can get down if you boss. Well, that defeats the point of getting back and forth. You yeah, but you could just way. still... Yeah, but the fact you could be like, where's your zip line? Peasants. That's what I'd be like. <laughs> yeah, and then he... I'm going to oh. zip line to the studio. And then that's not an upstairs; it's a roof box. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can just have like a little, a little, a little engines. And we don't let have Kyle. Up. We let <laughs> Kyle have ideas in the barn. <laughs> it's a good idea. Get yourself a zip line, and then have like a little pulley system to pull you back oh, up, and yeah, then you can just hang an on. An engine. <laughs> yeah. That's a that's a good one, Kyle. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You, just you just get shot through your bedroom window at 180 mile an hour. <laughs> Midget camera. <cannon. laughs> I don't have to say that word anymore. Yeah. Oh, no. Large, right. I, 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 large no, I gun. Used to, I used to say it because people call me, I'm getting the right word, aren't I? Yeah. And then he Be turned around and was like, you have to block that out because it's offensive. I was like, I get called it all the time. You're Someone, some, I saw it described as the M word. The M word? Yeah. Yeah. I was like, I was like, <laughs> I was like, dude, it's not that serious. No, it's not. It's not I, that deep, bro. That's so wow, funny. it's not that deep. Warwick Davis said on Twitter because someone asked him, someone was like, right, I'm set on this. Warwick Davis is midget, like offensive, and he was like, it's how it's said. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. It's, it's our it's, word, it's and we're taking it back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, it was, it's you, my if, word. Now I'm saying it. it to describe someone who's like smaller than normal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or like you know what is normal. Then, but if you like, if, you know, if you use it, if you you say it, it's derogatory, in a derogatory yeah. way, yeah, then yeah. it's derogatory kind of thing. Well, for example, like, it's nothing to do with any of us. I thought like, you were going to go, for example, like this derogatory <laughs> content. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking little. <laughs> <laughs> don't, 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 don't 
say, for example, at the end of that. Like this. I love how he looked over his shoulder as well, as we've already said it. Making sure no one's creeping in the corner. No, right. in, in, um, in, in Aussie, Aussie's, I don't know if you've read Aussie's book, but it's a great read if you haven't, do, because it's hilarious. But um, I think it was Diary of the Madman Tour, they employed, um, they employed like mi- midgets to hang on stage. What do you mean? <laughs> it's dramatic effect, it's theatre, isn't it? It's very spinal like, tap, like, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> Teddy Stone <laughs> No, I'm not joking. Like, like that's literally like, like, when you say dude, hang, don't like, shoot the messenger, bro. For real, bro. There's, There's a Stonehenge right monument in like, <laughs> danger of being crushed by a dwarf. He, but, the, but like he had, he had like a, he had like a midget executioner and everything as well. It wasn't just to hang him. But, like I oh, actually <laughs> was hang him, like hang him. By no, not little mouse trap. Like, I know not. They were on harnesses. It's just, no, it's was, it, was that what they were supposed? It was supposed to look like. Yeah, yeah, it was supposed to look like that. Yeah, one of these, one of these, one of these, one of these, like one of these dwarves was like a massive, like he used to. Booze like fuck. He was proper pisshead, and he, um, as he used to say, like he used to like. Playing, <laughs> he didn't want he, he, he said like he used to like playing pranks on him. He used to like playing pranks yeah. on him. He, he'd sit him on like the bar stool, but he'd get dead drunk and forget he was a dwarf, and then he'd try and get off the bar stool and splat on the ground. <laughs> okay. He's mad. But then, like, How do you forget? I don't know, you get drunk. But, just uh, anyway. Have a few drinks. Go six foot seven. Let's go. But, like, he, he said there was like this is this is going back to whether midgets okay or not. I promise. So like. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he was absolutely like blasted this little dude. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Out of the cannon. To, 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 to the point. To the point. To the point where like they have to literally like pick him up and get him to the bus, you know. But be- get him to the bus. But, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, that'll do. Get him in the one. van. But, but like. <laughs> he, he picked it, the, one of the road, sure. some big road. He picked him up by the belt and chucked him in the luggage bit. And then an old, a, a woman seen it happen. He was going, "You can't treat that poor man that way." And then the guy turned around, was like, "Fuck off, he's our midget." And then the dwarf, <laughs> poked, wait, the, the dwarf poked his head out the bag and was like, "Yeah, fuck off, I'm his midget." So, <laughs> so, so it's okay. Yeah. <laughs> Moral of the story: It's not bad. <laughs> in context. And if you don't believe me about that, read the book. It is. <laughs> Oh. I can't get over he hired midgets to hang from the stage. You're talking about Ozzy in the 80s. I like, don't yeah. understand why that is. Th- why, they were, they though? Like, <laughs> they were going through them. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you know what like, these things are they called? Where are we going to get more midgets? <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> two <laughs> days into the tour. And the next season, you know, you pick one up like that, let go, and then the one at the other end goes, oh, I've got well, one. Like it's a called. Newton's cradle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel like that statement wouldn't have been out of place on our tour, to be honest, the way it went. Like, I'm so warm, I'm sweating. Uh, I don't know if it's the nerves of this coming out or the heat, but it's one or the other. A bunch of Newton's cradle. Uh, well, so you can it was good while it lasted our career, like, yeah. it? I'm glad it seems to be going all right. You've got yeah. plenty of stuff going on, haven't you? It yeah. did seem to be going all right. Yeah, yeah. it seems Until to me, yeah. Do you like it? <laughs> <laughs> it's it all right. It lasted, it's got a few gigs lined up at the moment. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I can I can hold off releasing this until after the summer festival <laughs> season 20, if you want. 2025, it's all good. Yeah. <laughs> no, Christmas <we're>... special. <laughs> <laughs> we had the EP come out in March. That yeah, was so we good, did. wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was really good. Yeah, yeah it was, it's been well received. Mm. It's a bit heavier than what we did with Homecoming because we're still trying to find our feet with that one. But then now we kind of got a direct... Yeah, we got them now. <laughs> yeah. So we were telling everyone, we were like, don't expect Homecoming too because it won't be... And I think yeah. some people were like still expecting like, homecoming mm, too yeah. at first, but everyone seems to really, really enjoy it. Like who, mm. who already come to see us, so mm. you but still get people success. going. Oh, I love tear it down. You're Did like, you see? Thank what? you. But we don't play that anymore. We've not played yeah. that for like a year. Now. Paddy put like a post of saying, what? "Oh my gosh, Paddy, I've had a drink of a can on bourbon." Um, what's your favourite song from like the new EP? And someone was like, "I really love Alive Again." Like, did you even read this? Like, the, <laughs> sen- the sentence. Like, <laughs> thank you. The, I appreciate new EP. <laughs> we appreciate it, but that's the album. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> it always makes me think of a uh, Peep Show. You know, when, if you ever watched with, yeah. with Jeremy and uh, <laughs> Sophie's like cousin or whatever gives him a CD, he says, "Oh, did you get the chance to listen to my track?" Yeah, 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 I did. Uh, well, uh, did you like it? Yeah, yeah. What were your favourite bit? Oh, uh, I like the lyrics. Oh, there aren't any lyrics. <laughs> 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 that, uh-huh. that show, that show's goated. 
That oh, show it's is so funny. funny. <laughs> yeah. My, see, Libby, my wife, she won't watch it. She, she, oh, really? she, yeah. she, she'll smirk at things when she sees it, but she goes, she went, it just makes me feel on edge. I feel stressed and anxious <laughs> all the time while I'm watching it. I'm like, well, so like do the I. Camera, one of, like the camera angle, almost yeah. like, the, like the POV. One of the funniest things, I, I don't, have you seen the episode? I don't know. Like It's um, Jeremy's wedding, and he's like, he's in the back, he's, you know what I'm going to say, he's in the cubicle, he's like, super hands, <laughs> what is it like? And I'm what, I, what was it like a gram of coke or something? There was like a massive amount of cocaine. He's like, you can't do the speech. And then um, he's like, what do you mean he can't do the speech to kick open the door? And he's just clinging down for daylight. <laughs> and the cubicle, like, <laughs> pale as a sheet. Just like, oh. oh. <laughs> I've seen the peep show. That was show, like IT it's... crowd. And... Oh, oh, I know, like, I've just seen clips and screens. You've never watched it? Never seen peep Have show. Have you got Netflix? Yeah. Dude, get it. Get it on. Like, yeah. It gets on. better. <laughs> it just gets better Genius. as it goes along. It's It's... It's one of those, it's like, it will make you feel stressed because they've just got good intentions through most of it. Yeah. And, it just... and you just feel stressed for them that they don't go their way. And it's like, oh my God, I'm so anxious. And I'm like, well, I'm like this before I even put it on, so I'll <laughs> yeah. well just carry on. Yeah. Yeah. The bloke who plays Superhands does DJ sets in character. Does he? The Big Beat Manifesto. <laughs> yeah. My mate, my mate, see him at Glastonbury, did a guest DJ set at Glastonbury years ago as Superhands. See, there's there's T-shirts that I've seen that I wanted to buy with super hands on them. What? In fact, I've got one. I've got one that because he he did a thing where he bought a van and he he were telling Jeremy he's like, you need to buy a van so you can be a man with a van and to, then tomorrow we can be <laughs> men, men with, with Ven. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got a T-shirt that's like the Vans logo, over it says it says Ven, but then in tiny writing, men with. <laughs> Nobody has a clue what it is. Amazing. I always like. like I, I just want to walk. You want to walk around like somebody just like another like secret little cult peep show guy <laughs> yeah. kind of go. Someone in this oh yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Just for that validation of buying the t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing better than t-shirt validation, which I learned yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> Although me other one bought a sad little life, Jane. I love that t-shirt. It's like you're like kind of like eighty <laughs> style, where it just oh, says what a, sad little life yeah. what a sad little life, a sad little life, Jane. It's like kind of like montage. I love like it. TV, like Mount Ru- British TV, Mount Rushmore. He's on moments. there, absolutely. Like, yeah. yeah, hands down. The dude with for the whisk. A, for being a salty fucker. Yeah. <laughs> you won, Jane. <laughs> You have no decorum. <laughs> it's that is that is my it's Roman like, Empire. It's like I think someone about that. wrote a sketch about like it's like Americans wrote a sketch about like how British people act but then, when they're yeah, upset. But, then but it's it real life. Happened. Yeah, yeah. Like it's, oh, An it's accurate sketch. Yeah, I couldn't even make it up. <laughs> I need more meme T-shirts now. I've seen one. I want to get the um. It's I've seen one. It says a succulent <laughs> Chinese meal. And I really need that one. Like, I, bought a shirt I don't know if anyone. You know, oh, I don't, you know, judo, sir. Even though I don't know what that one is. Have you not oh, seen bro, it? Oh, It's like an old guy getting getting shoved in a police car, S- getting S- arrested. S- so what he was doing was he was um, going to restaurants, eating, and then running away and not paying. <laughs> And then they finally caught him, and he's just getting arrested, and he's going, "Gentlemen, oh, this I, is democracy, yeah. man." Yeah. I have seen that. I have seen that. Yeah, this is democracy. It's the voice that the voice yeah. that brought it back. Get your hand off my penis! <laughs> it's got me by the penis, people. <laughs> Sometimes I just quote that to myself, even when I'm no no one's around, I'm just walking around. I believe it. Yeah, I believe it, dude. Yeah, I'm not hitting that bell. I know. <laughs> it's it's a full full on fact. <laughs> My poor housemate will just hear me every now and again going a succulent Chinese meal. <laughs> and you're eating an Indian. <laughs> just bread. Um. <laughs> <laughs> There's a stain on this bread. This <laughs> is seeded more than normal. <laughs> The seeds haven't solidified. Oh. <laughs> oh, do, you remember, do you remember them iced buns? Yeah, <laughs> glazed, glazed buns. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> One of them. <laughs> Homebrew. Get absolutely With the slit. Nah. Oh my god. <laughs> With a See, if, you, if you ever used to go, which you won't have done, drinking in Barnsley, like when I were about 18, across from what used to be uh, Heaven and Hell nightclub is on Regent Street, there used to be this little 
gardens yeah. <laughs> and there were so many women at like two three in the morning that looked like them buns oh, no. <laughs> oh. just walking out like oh, <laughs> oh, oh she's got a runny nose oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> must, have a, must have a special on super glue oh. <laughs> you've got a bit of hot to on your chin oh. <laughs> it's horrible if they walk and just see one of them just slip <laughs> <laughs> oh no, he slipped on cum. It'd be funnier if her foot got stuck to the floor and it's just like gorilla glue. Uh, <laughs> what, what, what the fuck? fuck? <laughs> it's like the crazy old. Someone needs to get in the like, hospital. Oh, like, 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 you just, like, sometimes you just have to accept that you've got to leave the shoes behind. <laughs> <laughs> they belong They belong to the crazy yeah, house now. Because the floors shoes, in the there were like historically, biblically sticky. sticky. Do you ever go out yeah. for a night out in Liverpool? Do you go to crazy house? Uh, I've not been in there, but I've, I've had a couple of nights in Liverpool. Yeah. In fact, I went, I went to Liverpool uh, straight after our tour. Uh, yeah, I was like five days before they locked it down. Oh. Went, cause my birthday is like 16th of March, so you know, in case you need to send a card. And uh, oh. and they were like, it was just like that. That's my birthday there. Went out for a few days. Went out, stayed in Liverpool. I stayed somewhere. It's like on the docks. I forgot the, that's the one. Mm. That's or a like, bougie ass gaff. He's, yeah, well, yeah. well, yeah. he's, he's covert posh. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> right, I'd like to stay We're in a studio. Hotel. What do you mean? Like, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, true. <laughs> He's not covert, posh. <laughs> He's just posh. Let's <laughs> us go and premiere in. Like, lovely. <laughs> Titanic Hotel for me, please. I didn't know what it were. I just it just looked, it just looked it cool. Nice. It looked nice. So we're like, yeah, we'll go there. Yeah. And just and that and I went around Liverpool then. But we went with some friends. Uh, oh God, this were like during lockdown times. So it was all still a bit weird. But when I went, first went, it were there were people running around with masks on still. Like it weren't. People had talked about it and then the news, but they're not actually like said, "Oh, yeah, it's uh, you, have to. you have to wear a mask." And I'm like, "Why are they, is everyone wearing a a mask? It's yeah. a bit weird. Like everyone's concealing their identity in Liverpool." No, no. Yeah. It's because they never yeah. rob you. Yeah. <laughs> normal, normal, normal behaviour. We don't, we don't rob anyone. Yeah. <laughs> Balaclavas. Yeah. <laughs> I saw someone yesterday. It was like. Speak of, in a balaclava. It was like they were flying past us in New Brighton. And they were on like a bike, but they had shorts on, t shirts on, and a bally. I'm just saying. Like, warm, isn't it? That's <laughs> as slav as you get in it. Really, really. Sun's out, ballies out, it's, let's go. It's for the midges. <laughs> yeah. Stuck I've to been your face. bitten by so many midges, I hate it. The when you when you got like mega bitten at Wildfire, oh, was it Wildfire? It was Wildfire. She yeah. looked like a leper. It was disgusting. Yeah. I woke up in the tent and I was like, oh. And like, it's like, like open my eyes. I was thinking, what the fuck is that? <laughs> The light in the, in the tent, because it was green, it like illuminated it more. And like my legs, there wasn't like a part you could see that wasn't a red lump. And I was like, Ugh. I don't know how. Everyone's like, no, it's not that bad. And I'd lift up my pants and they were like, fully the base of quarantine. Like, <laughs> were this like in the, it's current location? Yeah, yeah, I think like it's in the Scottish. Well, yeah, was, like, yeah, yeah, grass. yeah, yeah. I had like leggings on with like a little mesh bit at the front. And I think because the grass was long, obviously as I'm walking through, I've just fucking collected them in the front of the mesh or something, I don't know. But the old it was horrific. Feast. Yeah, it was horrific. <laughs> and have tasty blood, apparently, according to them. So. <laughs> they love my legs as well. Must be like girly looking legs. <laughs> 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 Honestly, I get like absolutely shafted by them at night time. It's just at home, to be yep. fair. Oh, they don't touch Libby and she's near it at window. I'm like, man, sleep near door, you know, and yeah. she's, they just bypass her. Because she's she goes to the gym and stuff all the time, so she's got like strong legs. And they just go, oh, get these little skinny girl legs in. <laughs> <laughs> Easier to get to the blood. Yeah. <laughs> You're worth traveling for. Yeah. Make me feel special. <laughs> Let's go to the nice legs. <laughs> <laughs> oh so you're uh, you've got loads of festivals coming up. Uh, yeah. You've done. You've, you've had. You've not really stopped, have you? Really, because like. Like when when it come to lockdown, we just hid away and says, right, balls to this, we're just going into studio and we're just gonna hmm. yeah. spend a long time on something until we go mental. And you guys just, just kept going. You were like pretty relentless, weren't you? You're still playing live but recording as well. Yeah, so yeah, uh, yeah. and writing to a to a lesser extent writing, but we finished the album off too. Yeah, because mm. yeah. we wrote the 
we wrote it in lockdown. Yeah. I actually, the album. It was then, summer 2020. It, and, you know when the lockdown rules kind of lifted a little bit in the summer? Yeah, remember? Yeah. And everyone, basically just to get everyone in the pubs and get them pissed and boost the economy, let's mm. be fair. But like, <laughs> the, and it was the same around where we were recording because it was pretty much all bars and pubs and restaurants and mm. rammed. But we kind of used that little opening to get some studio time booked and get mm. the album done. Yeah. And then I actually think it was... Think it was four years today that oh. we were and like that we finished oh. maybe i just know because i've been checking on my memories and it's like day two day three yeah, so we're yeah. it's either day four or it's the final day yeah did we do, did we do five days? Days? what rain man memory over oh, no no just oh. facebook memories oh, well. it, if you knew how to use your phone you'd be able to see <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Touché. How's he remembering all these? I'm just there, like, he's cheating. <laughs> <laughs> we just did that because we, we'd obviously only done, like, it was the tour with you guys and then, like, three dates, I think, were, like, killing over and all them. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And that was, mm-hmm. like, the that only gigs cool. we'd done, I think. And then everything shut down. So we were like, oh, let's let's do everything. It stopped. So we are like, well, we need to write then just so yeah. something to listen to, I guess, Keep while we can't go right. out. And then as soon as it did lift... We were like, right, let's just get all the gigs in and oh. try and just tour this we album. Didn't, we, we didn't stop from when the gates opened back up, like halfway through 2021, all of, through all of 2022. Mm. It was just gig, 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 like relentless. Like every weekend or other weekend, we were away. Mm. From the whole year, boss. the whole to the point where last year we were like, yeah, we need to have a year off and come up with new music because we couldn't possibly <laughs> smash it more than we did last yeah. year. And oh, yeah, half before, we'd yeah. been everywhere twice and it was like well we probably need to and then people cause... just started asking for more music and they were <coughs> like yeah, that we was the more? kicker one they were like oh when are we going to get new stuff it's like fuck no we've only just been able to gig this no, I, know, no. Yeah. I know the album's old but gigging it isn't yeah, 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 because yeah, yeah. yeah. we were still like, trapped no. for a while we got like re-trapped after we'd finished yeah. recording so it was like it wasn't it was like probably close to a year before we could actually gig the album so it was mm-hmm. already like yeah. been out a while but yeah, yeah we, knew we, we knew we needed to get some new stuff done as well. So. But then we, we, we took the back seat on the gigs because as soon as there's a gig coming up, you kind of use the practices before the gig to practice for the gig. So then rather than writing more stuff, we were just practicing what we already had. So we were like, right, we need to just not book any for a while so we can no, focus yeah. fully on writing. Yeah, we can't be meeting up like three times a week. <sighs> no. Can't be, a, can't be having that life. It's too dangerous and well, expensive, but mostly you know, dangerous. he lives in the house. <laughs> I can't afford us. the bread. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's gone up as well, hasn't it, in the yeah. last four years? Oh, bro. Yeah. Oh, I know, sorry. It's, no, uh, it's, it's, right. it's, it's ridiculously warm here. <laughs> I mean, like, on the camera, you're just going to see it. Like be glistening in the corner. <laughs> cr- crazy insulated room. So, you know, this this you've turned up on like the, the four days where we're getting sunshine in, in yeah. Britain. So <laughs> yeah. it's been building up in here. A greenhouse effect inside here. But no, it's, uh, I'm going to get some air con at some point, I've decided. It's, yeah, uh, nice. But That's nice. it's, uh, it's... It's not. It's not cheap though. When you want it for soundproofed one, yeah. 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 So you got to no, get some like so. weird box put outside the building that's got like a big pipe because apparently the sound bounces against all the angles and stops oh, really? it. Oh really? That's what I've read. Might be a lot of crap just to charge an extra hundred quid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> They'll it, fall for this. I, I can ask. Just put that, acoustic though. at the beginning of it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. I can ask. Yeah. That, it, whereabouts would you put it though? Would it be like? Down here, down here, or where you mainly I'd sit? I'd just like? take one of these off the wall. Yeah. And then uh, replace it with a box. Nice. How much does that cost? A lot. Yeah. <laughs> even, more even, even, again. even more to run the thing. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, true. Which is, it, it'd be no good even when you know, if you record, you know yourself when you're recording like vocals, you don't want aircon on. Yeah. No. No. It kills you, doesn't it? It like, absolutely yeah. kills you. It just wipes you out. Like, when I've done tours, I'll be like, I'm better in a sweat box than I am yeah. if you go somewhere a bit snazzier. You do like an O2 room and they've got air con blasting. And yeah. the yeah, day yeah. after, you're just literally... All these, and they do, and they do the, the like mega fog. And I'm just like... Just put some, just put some <laughs> fans on the stage around The amount of people we've pissed off by going, our singer's asthmatic, can you not put the fog on, please? And they're like, but it's going to look shit. It's going to look shit. And you think, <laughs> and you're like, but he's asthmatic. And like, also, yeah. it's just what... Yeah, I'm you'd rather like, he sound better. You've than got all like these beams from moving yeah. heads and yeah. cars yeah. laid on floor. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm just there, like can't breathe. Someone pass me an inhaler. Yeah, like, <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, the lights all look shit, and it's just like, well, 
we, we don't just stand there. We do bounce around and jump all... all if all, you all, sing a fog machine, machines are essentially big vapes. Yeah. Because you're just sucking them in, aren't you, really, when you yeah. breathe in between words? It does kill me throat out, though, mm. as well. I, 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 I've got the sense for mine, because I've got a couple of Martin ones, like one on its own will fill up like a thousand cap nightclub on its own, just on its own. Yeah. <laughs> the mental. You connect them together with this, like, Ethernet cable. And now, <laughs> first time, I'm like, oh, you can buy this scented stuff. I, like, bought cherries or something fruity. And then I'm like, yeah. you get one that smells of weed. <laughs> so I'm like, <laughs> oh, <laughs> really? this is going to really confuse people. <laughs> <laughs> we used to take them when we when we used to do our zone gigs we would take a PA with us and stuff and we and I'd set that up with some lights and you could see people looking around like who's yeah, got who's got big bifter on going on <laughs> this? this is the biggest big weed. Bifter this is the biggest weed cloud I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Selling toast mat bar at hundred miles an hour. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How many people do you think would have like a context high from it though? Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, what are they called? So blazed. Um, what's it called when you give so say like a paracetamol but you say it's a cozy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be interesting. I'm a, I'm a ghost stoner. <laughs> do it. You can next just, just weed the whole place out with the fake smell and then just have and see, fake the, smell. see how many Real people weed but a fake smell. Yeah, yeah. And see how many people get Blazed. Oh, the lunch yeah. weed. Like, <laughs> lucky as all. Fakers. <laughs> I'm I'm skeptical. I'm skeptical about the fog, because I sing now, and no matter how foggy it is, I'm fine. So yeah. Are I you asthmatic though? I think he's just. I don't know. <laughs> when I not. when I run, it hurts. <laughs> that's not that's asthma though. <laughs> no. that, that's that, just might be, that might be just that's, me. that's Greg's. That. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. Greg's is fancy, dude. It's, it's expensive. He's but, a palm yeah. bakery guy. Oh, oh, yeah. yeah. It's literally the only place you can get a cold pasty in a warm bottle of water. It's just yeah. weird. Yeah, yeah. We've, got, we've got three within a mile of each other in Barnsley Centre. You, you can you can walk, I don't know, two minutes maximum and you hit a Greg's. They're just everywhere in Barnsley. They love them. Like a the pub crawl, but with bakery. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Going for a Greg's People crawl. People about yeah. it like it's like a national treasure. And I just think it's like... The bussies are all right. Dude, it's, it's very yeah. nice. They do a nice to hot the chocolate. Point, to the point where a pasty shop has merch. You've summed it up perfectly. Yeah. Like a cold pasty Greggins. and a piss warm bottle of water. So Greg's is just a bit shit. Like, you go in Greg's though and it's like all the hot holes are literally that hot holes. So how, how the hell are they the coming out cold? The, you know, the, the, the holes? The, the, you know, it's just you lamps. See the, it's oh, an illusion. Yeah. yeah, but the, the halogen lamps, they should yeah, keep them warm. The, no, 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 they just apparently, them yellow. They're not allowed to reheat them. No. They're not, yeah, they're not allowed Dude, to keep them heated because of the tax. When I was a pasty tax. <laughs> when I was, do, I was doing work. <laughs> I'm, I'm <laughs> not even joking. That's a thing, a real thing. Yeah. You have to like, Pay a troll, a sausage roll to get past it. No, no, so... <laughs> past it was, tax. It was when, or you're not going to work. It was when David Cameron was you in, and he was just like, if you, he, if, you, if you sell heated food, it's going to cost more. That's why, you know, when you're like... Um, like if that's why like Greg's were just like well we're not gonna heat our food then we're just gonna defrost. Well no no they, they cook it at the beginning they like, yeah yeah but then they the don't oven, but then they just put them out no, on I don't the front. Think they do, yeah. you know because when I went I, I worked for it's like put a, them in the, like, I, I, the I worked for a stock going. company. I just remember it being all over the news. <laughs> and and we we had to go to Wales one time and it was like Wales? it, it had was to. like no it was like twenty yeah. past five in the morning and it was like the Greg's opens in ten minutes so we were like oh all these pasties are gonna be boiling it's gonna be so nice and I went in there. Oh, well, maybe they were doing it wrong. Freezing cold chicken bake from yesterday. And I was like, this is the worst start to There's any day. Throw them out. I'm not a morning. I'm, I'm, anyone who knows How me knows take I'm them not out the oven in the cold. Probably. Dude, anyone who knows me knows I'm not a morning person. So the fact that I was up at that at ungodly yeah. hours already shit. And then the first thing I put in my mouth is a fucking ice cold chicken bake. I was like, I'm ready to turn it in. Are you sure they just didn't take it out of the freezer by mistake? And they were God. about they were about to put it in the fucking no, oven. And you're just like, yeah, and I love that lot. No, I saw a pull. It from under the like the desk, like in the front. Like yeah, but that's glass. if it's in the front, then it's not. That's yesterday, you, that... bro. You just at yesterday's. Greg. Why are they serving yesterday's? Grub? <laughs> no, they shouldn't be doing yesterday's. Why are we but serving like... yesterday? So that's been out all night, hasn't yeah, it? Even but today's isn't that good. No. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> today's is <laughs> yesterday's. <laughs> For real. Oh, dude, it's I was the, I was like I'm just amazed that they'll always like oh are you eating in and then so they charge you more it's like yeah. oh, so I can enjoy this fine establishment. No, no, yeah. <laughs> are you plate. gonna even give me cutlery? No. <laughs> no like... There's nowhere even to sit in a Greg's. Yeah, I don't know. Some of them have got little seats and yeah, stuff. I always do. just go oh, I'm taking away fancy. and then I walk near the door and then I do a little quick 
cheeky turn. Do you know what? Right? Yeah. <laughs> that was. <laughs> sit, sit down, have a quick snap on the there, going, you bastard. Yeah. Yeah. Chasing you, you just sit by it. You owe this company 25 pence. I got, I got <laughs> terrored in there, um, the, uh, Matthew Street. There's a couple of Greg's. There's one in Queen Square. There's one in Matthew Street. And you get you get fucking terrored in Matthew Street by seagulls if you walk through with Greg's sausage rolls. I shit you not. <laughs> like, they swoop down and rob them off you while you're mid bite, bro. Be fair, the seagulls in town are like violent, like, they are Chernobyl, like, yeah, like yeah. Werewolves, mutants. Yeah. They are seagulls. super They're violent. Like They're small dog size, yeah. Yeah, they are. They're yeah. horrible. They're, huge. They're like the ones in Cornwall. They don't care. They just like, you, you could be holding brick sized. Cornish pasty, and they just and they grab would, it off yeah. you. Didn't didn't a seagull fuck off with a dog once? Yeah, yeah yes. it took a chihuahua. It took a chihuahua. I've seen I've seen a, in person seen a seagull. Like, laugh. Yeah, Frank, like, he's seen a seagull in person. Frank I've too. seen a seagull in person. Frank's too fat. There's no, another you're, T-shirt. No, you're, you're telling stories about them. I've seen one. Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever even seen a seagull? No, you know the way like snakes will just like n- like eat something whole. Yeah. Like oh, we eat the rabbit. I, I seen a seagull in town oh, yeah, the, eat a pigeon. Like, yeah, it was. Yeah, 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 yeah. You should have said that part, it? then said in person. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Birds after like. I seen a seagull no, no. eat a pigeon in a person. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> in town. It's like one of them Christmas dinners where they stuff, keep stuffing birds yeah, inside yeah. different like, birds. Like a Russian doll of birds. In a, yeah. in a homeless guy. In a Greg. In a sand dog. <laughs> it's like, it's like, Three birds it's like heavy them. Russian dolls. <laughs> There was, um, when I used to, like, live in Minehead, when I was working in Butlands, I was, like, literally, like, coming home with a sausage roll, and, like... That's not very g- nice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so... <laughs> Call said, Emma. Said, Call said, Emma. Get your coat, you fool. She was a flaky girl. Uh, <laughs> psoriasis just gets me, I was going to uh. say. <laughs> so I was, I was, like, literally Very peppery walking taste. <laughs> <laughs> so I was walking over with sausage roll, and like people were just like, oh hello, because like, they know you're there. I'm like, you're right. And a seagull full on lands on my shoulder, tries to swipe it off me, and I just punch the seagull. <laughs> and someone genuinely put a complaint in about me saying I was assaulting animals. <laughs> I was like, yeah, he was just saving a sausage roll. Oh yeah, I was like, right, I was just done like a ten hour shift. I was fucking starving. <laughs> like, it's mine. And, and no food in the house. I'm going to be asked going to so the hard shop and cooking. Life. Yeah. <laughs> I will defend for my life. <laughs> <laughs> it was just yeah. crazy. <laughs> just taking it to the office going, we've got a complaint about you punching Lizzie a seagull. <laughs> <laughs> like, it was going for me. It was just a reaction. I was like, shit. I thought I was trying to peck my eyes out. You can lose your job for anything now, can't you? <laughs> God, yeah. Spitting. That's why you go self-employed, and then only I can make me lose my job now. <laughs> <laughs> just put, put yourself into your own office. First thing she does before she turns on the machine, just punch a seagull. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> giving yourself a complaint, you're just there like, do you know why you're here? Can't no. wait for someone to go, can You've I speak to the manager? And then it's just like... It's me. Surprise, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> I am the Do manager. that little spin around. Okay, yeah, one second spin and then look back and be like, hello, how can I help you? <laughs> <laughs> they already all think it's him as soon as they walk in. Someone's trying to like sell us stuff and they won't even look at me. Like this old man, he just keeps Does going to Paddy. Like... And it's like, Fuck you, you off, can't me, say yes like... to anything. It's me who can say <laughs> yes to buying stuff. Just... When he comes in, he's like, oh, I'd love to, you know, supply your, your shop with, uh, you know, I've got gloves, cleaning equipment, all the rest of it. And I'm just like looking at the laptop. No, like, so you just like, yeah. fully hair. ignoring him, but just like nodding and going like, I'm going to speak to her. Watching hey, Seagull eat a pigeon Jeez. on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nature is metal. That was, Instagram. In, that was in oh, person. Don't, in, <laughs> don't insult me with that YouTube. I'm going to tell people I saw this. <laughs> is this the bullshit button? <laughs> I was there. Ah, <laughs> it burns. I only did it really soft. <laughs> Well, no, easy, he's, he's easy in gently. I love pigeons as well, so cute. So seagulls. You're the only box. person I know who goes, oh, pigeons are that cute. They half are the time, cute. half of them have got just a stump for a leg and stuff like that. Yeah, like, you'd be an ableist. No, I'm just saying they piss on themselves so much yeah. that they rot their own feet. No, they and you're don't. like, oh, that's people delightful. On them. Some no, people they do yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, they can't, scro- they can't <laughs> scroll through TikTok, can they? They do it with the feet. Hedgehogs are cute, but you're guaranteed to get fleas off them. They're still cute. Yeah. 
Yeah, but they don't piss on They're the really legs cute. and lose a limb. No, but they'll fuck your clothes in your house up by giving you fleas. People used to have pigeons as pets. They're, they're it's non-destructive. Pretty firm on that. That's true. Yeah, the, the passion is I'm real. lying and dying. Like. <laughs> I'm dying right now. Yeah, this fellow's convinced that it's my shop, and I'm just like, dude, like, speak to the boss. Like, she's right there. She's Sim- like, he goes like, what do you want? And I'm like, I have a price list or a list of things I can see, and he's like, no, just tell me what you want, and I'll get it. I'm like, no, because I don't know how much it is. That's not. We're a small business. You go. I've got it. You buy it. When it comes back, is yeah, that's like eighty quid. That and you're like, our sources, back, our then. sources include. Trust me, bro. <laughs> I, I, just I, I, into him, like, I, I just fucking don't. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know who you are. <laughs> I'm just like Amazon does it, mate. There's no point you coming around. Think it's it's like it's happened even at gigs. Like how many times people have gone to you and gone, do you know who the drummer is? Oh yeah. And you're like, I, t- I think I told. Tell them the my, best story. Uh, well, it's it, it's well, up it's there. That's the worst story, but it's the best. No, it's like. It's, it's the just, best example of something yeah. shit. So we played a gig age ago. I think it was even before uh, Joe and Kyle were in the band. And it was, I think it was at like a, a biker club or something. And it was us and this other band were on. They were headline, we were support. And like the drummer was setting up on the stage. So I went up to him, you know, being the drummer, like t- t- talking to him about the drum kit, you know, what what are you using? What am I bringing of mine on? Blah, 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 blah. It's been some like 20 minutes about the drums and what I'm going to be using. And then he turns around to his singer and goes like, hey, mate, where's the drummer for the other band? And he was like, you're speaking to me in our bed? And he went like, <laughs> and he went like, oh, I thought she just wanted to fuck about with the kid. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, no. <laughs> So naturally, I'm just a creepy. So naturally, like any good partner, I just laugh. <laughs> <I'm laughs> <laughs> ah, we had your mates, we had you. You were gonna let it have a go. <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> I mean, why, like, why was he even like speaking back? To me? I don't know. You should have like doubled down on it and go. No, I am the drum. Then get on, go. Yeah. Right. Yeah. What, what do, do I, I hit? Do? Like, so. I love it when no, people wait, go wait to me. To go, I now the kick and then just much. fucking kick something over. <laughs> I, I always get the backhanded compliments. Like people come up to me going, "You know what? I didn't expect much." Like on a soy or something. <laughs> but yeah, actually, it's really good. And someone once said to me as well, "You know what? You're the best female drummer that I've ever seen in the south of Wales or something." And I was like, "Why are you narrowing it down between seven and three? Yeah. 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 So you're this... the only drummer you've seen in the south of Wales in this venue." <laughs> I'm, I'm not. I'm not like uh, being, you know, horrible. The other two are pretty good, but. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> To be fair, I always introduce Josh by saying things like, oh, the best drummer on stage tonight. (laughs) (laughs) Which is not even true, because Jake's Jake's better than him. (laughs) (laughs) Oh shit, does Jake play drums? Yeah, really well. Yeah, Yeah, not, not like... Four hours into rehearsal when I have a go. <laughs> it's like, oh, Josh has gone to the toilet. He comes back and I'm on his stool. <laughs> Trying to do a break now. I know, yeah. It was, um, you had that really nice compliment when in the review they said your really high vocals were absolutely oh, yeah. stunning. Do you think I sing before Paddy as well? Yeah. Like, basically like Kyle sounds like a woman yeah. I, 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 yeah. my high notes it was like oh he- hearing Jess's beautiful harmonies and I'm just like no they're mine yeah. if my I feel your pain <laughs> they wouldn't be Thank beautiful you. if they were mine and that. <laughs> although you are in the album I and am. in the EP but you're in Epiphany speaking mm. no because you're doing that she's being oh, stalked yeah. she's being stalked if I'm in Prey the voicemail divide the little Epiphany bit in the middle, yeah. like the Epiphany as well. and then Epiphany just mm. parts of the woes. I said pray first. Did you? Oh, yeah. I can't remember. <laughs> my, <laughs> my mind just went no, off. To be then. fair, that was ages ago. Yeah, yeah like, like a, a full, like like a ten, full ten seconds. Ago, ten yeah, seconds. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah. You're in more than that, aren't you? No. Yeah, because you're in um, Lost as well. Yeah, you are. You are oh, actually, yeah. 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 Is, it all, so is it all speaking parts, or are you, are you singing? Well, in Epiphany, it's woes underneath yeah. that, you know, in, like, the, the verse. So you can sing, you just choose not to. Lost just singing as well. In the, in the mixture of everyone else's voice, when they're all together, it goes It's, it goes yeah, it's the salt base. To be spray, fair, yeah. I know there's people like that, though, like, they can pitch an harmony, and... Yeah. When it's all together, it sounds great. Yeah. When they're on their own, I'm like, oh, you won't go to lead singer's voice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. That, that yeah, one, yeah. then probably, yeah. 
that one. I am one of those people. For Same. Real. I really do harmony. <laughs> I just make toilet bowl noises when yeah, they need yeah, it. They I'm a textural singer. <laughs> That's about it, lad. <laughs> oh, you're 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 just kicking you're up. Fucking oh. hysterical. I know. I'm, I'm caused the scene. scene. <laughs> I'm inside and the hay fever's kicking off. <laughs> it's horrendous though, isn't it? It's like I, I, I just lose my voice completely. Like oh. April time onwards, always which is when we fever. always decide to tour. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. we had our first show in lockdown, and it was like a live webcam show. Oh yeah. And hay fever just decided to just absolutely. But fuck me in the mouth. That's the only way to describe it. Fuck you in the mouth. I was, he's got a bum old mouth. Yeah, same. I was fully violated by hay fever. Same skin, isn't it? So. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't you know, like, see properly. <laughs> like, my eyes were fucking... Like, I'll never, sh- I'll never trust the shot. blindfold again. <laughs> Yeah, I was like fully like gone. I just couldn't like my nostrils were just like seized. Why is your spit gone. brown? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and it was his tongue's falling out. Is that like Maltese? <laughs> <laughs> We were doing this gig and it was like a fucking live webcam show and we're in the hottest room known to man. I suppose a live webcam show is the best place to get fu- butt fucked in the mouth. <laughs> to get quite a, quite a, quite a, quite a oh, fitting fuck. location. What's the only there's a, the only there's a foot now. To get fucked. This is getting really complicated. Yeah. So yeah. Imagine the angles. <laughs> yeah, and it was just... I just couldn't hit a single fucking note and I was so fuming. we got some fans of that gig. How? I don't know. Well, you do look back at the videos and it's like... uh, It makes me so angry watching it because I'm just like, we couldn't cancel. So I just had to just thingy and there was like a lot of people watching and I'm yeah, just there like going people yeah. yeah and I'm just like oh no me angry as well, it's our introduction like... to a lot of people and it should yeah I was trying to hit the big notes and my voice just went break nope. through the wall <laughs> <laughs> no and I'm like oh it's the worst thing is it's still up there on YouTube and yeah. sometimes you know why YouTube likes to like go yeah I have a suggestion yeah. and I'm like no and so stop. don't show me this shit dude. It's, like, it's, it's like stop giving me PT SD. <laughs> like, I don't mm. like that. I, don't, I do not like I this. I do not me. like this. I'm going to report this video. <laughs> it's not as bad as though, well, it was much worse, but when we were playing KK Steel oh, Mill for the first time, and we just played Steel House not so long ago, and, you know, big intro, everyone's going for it. We've just done the first song, and I went, Steel How! No, you said Steelhouse. You said yeah. the whole I said, thing. Yeah. No, if you listen, I <laughs> stopped. You said KK Steelhouse. I went Steel How. No, you and said KK Steelhouse. I will house. find that fucking How video. Mill. And I was like, oh, but now I just say KKs. What about that time when we just finished playing Prey and he went, oh, yeah. Thanks everyone. This next song's called Prey. And then he's like, no, it isn't. We no, it's not. It's one. alive again. <laughs> Let's play it again. Yeah. No, it's, we only had five songs at that time yeah. as well. So. <laughs> I was caught up in the moment. Yeah, I was yeah. just like, yeah, Prey was really good. That's crowd. why I don't sing. I just get tongue twisted all the yeah. time. Could never be someone at the front. Uh, Disgusting. Yeah. No. But we we carry on. We move. But yeah, that hay fever time was horrible. <laughs> it scares me. It's, you can't blame the hay fever for the uh, getting the location mixed up. Though, <laughs> no, no, no. That, that's just. <laughs> That was that just a full on. fucked me. That... <laughs> I, I've seen a club band playing Doncaster and the, the singer shouted, make some fucking noise, Sheffield. And they no. all just looked at each other Ooh. like, oh, oh, bro. Bro. <laughs> that's <laughs> enemy <laughs> territory, <laughs> bro. <laughs> there was a band, they not say who it was, but they were, what, where did they confuse it for? It was Blackpool. I know it was Blackpool. We were in Blackpool. And he went, scream, he, like, he scream went, for it, me in Manchester. And they went, it's Blackpool, you cunt. <laughs> <laughs> The singer just didn't say anything. <laughs> he had like a bottle of like JD no, on the drum they, riser they behind him. They had that much, and they all took oh, a sip no. of this bottle of JD before the gig. So it was so cringe. It was cringe. It was like that much in it, and they were like, "Pass it on." But he goes like, "Blink, <laughs> lazy in the Jack <laughs> Daniels." <goes, like, laughs> you know, good either Manchester or wherever. She shouts, "It's Blackpool, you cunt!" And he just goes. <laughs> 
and just goes across <laughs> the bridge. And then, and then carries on. As if that didn't you just happen. Just, you could have just make a joke out of it. Laugh it off. No, he's just like, he was like, I know, I'll just pretend that didn't happen at all. I just love the fact that Heckler even went... I'm like, like, like fucking Tourette's. Just like, <laughs> it was, um, when I saw My Chemical Romance in Warrington, he kept calling it Manchester. Oh no. And he was like, Manchester! And uh, like, it's not, Warrington's not even in Manchester. I suppose to Americans though, oh, yeah. when they when they're looking at the it's distances, all yeah. yeah, to them, because so. because like the UK is like smaller than a state, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just like oh, they must they must be able to walk from here to there. Yeah. It's like he, towns to yeah. them, isn't it? Everywhere's going. walking distance if you've got time. To be fair, he kept going on about it, and then people kept going. It's it's Warrington, and he just went. Who the fuck knows where Warrington is? Yeah, yeah he's got a point. Yeah, that's fair. There's a point. Whenever people ask where I'm from, I just say Liverpool because I cannot be asked describing with me. And I just say, I say Runcorn and they go, where? And I go, do you know the song, uh, the, the show Two Pints of Lager? And they're like, oh yeah. And I'm like, yeah, yeah. And then they go, oh, what's it like? I'm like, well, the pub's a Buddhist monk temple now, so it's changed. Oh my, is it? Yeah, yeah, it's legit. It's, it's, it's yeah. Full on Buddhist monk temple. It's class. Class, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's, I it's bet cool. everybody already had the hairstyle anyway, didn't they? So. <laughs> 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 I think you're only 20 minutes from Liverpool. Everyone just, mm. it's easier. No one knows where the wheel yeah. is. I know, like, but I don't want to be people going, oh, look at that plastic scouser. I'm like, I've never claimed to be scouts. Anyway. I'll always say Runcornian. That is like, where are you from, Runcorn? Like, I'm not going to be like, I'm from Liverpool. Yeah, but like, who told you to do that? What? No one said like that. Do that. That's what people are like, though. You got like Mel C and what's the face from Girls Aloud? Mel C's from Witness. And you got like um, what's it? Nicola from Girls Aloud. She's like, I'm from Liverpool. And it's like, no, you weren't. (laughs) You're from Runcorn. Calm down. (laughs) We had to lie though when we went to Thailand because trying to explain Barnsley to a (laughs) mum got really complicated. (laughs) So we just go, you know Sheffield? Yes, yes, Sheffield United, Sheffield Wednesday. Yeah, yeah. And then they're like going, Sheffield Wednesday. Like, yeah, like, I don't, that's not a tight accent. I don't know why I'm doing it like that. <laughs> You're banned. In Thailand, they're just like, yeah, Sheffield Wednesday. <laughs> An authentic Thai accent right there. <laughs> It's because uh, it's because they were from there and they were on holiday as well. <laughs> they were just they just happened to be of yeah, Asian yeah. descent. <laughs> You're fucking round corner. <laughs> Massage parlor shut for two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what? I've, I've, until this moment, I've steered clear of accents because <laughs> it's. It used to be great. It's, like, it's, a, a, it's a, sketchy an, a, an accent impression were great, and you just you just can't do it anymore. It's very close to being just getting the accent wrong or just being really racist. Yeah. <laughs> There's no in between. If, if you nail it, yeah, you've got, you've got, you've got to. And then it. if you do nail it, it's still like that's really racist. I know. Yeah. Someone, every time they try to do an accent, they just slip into Indian, no matter yeah. what. Yeah. Yeah. They do. I, I know somebody that tries to do a Geordie accent, it always sounds Indian. Yeah. Like, within three oh, seconds. Yeah. It, the thing is, though, they say Indian, but it's just really like like horrendous stereotype. Yeah, like, don't, don't even sound yeah. Indian. They say "why I" but in an Asian accent. It's so <laughs> weird. <laughs> uh, it does. Uh, I, think, uh, I think you can get away with it if you absolutely nail it, like spot on. You can. But then I if mean, you don't, you're a gimmick. I don't see like, like, well, What you like, said was offensive, but very accurate. <laughs> <laughs> That's super like racist. Wrist, yes, we do actually have smaller penis. <laughs> <laughs> but you got the region great, so we'll let it off. It's like, I mean, you can do. I mean, I could do, you know, Scottish, Irish, whatever. But if you do a perfect accent of someone a different colour than you, it's suddenly like, it's suddenly it's like, oh, room. fucking hell, what's he doing? Oh, <laughs> like, well, Joe's just there, like, oh, for fuck's sake, the career's over. It's over now. He's not even warm. He's just worried. <laughs> That's it, it's, it's, it's the sweat. Oh, he means Joe too, I think, in the oh, background. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Big no, no, Joe. Yeah. Or the, or the Joe. My dad's sitting there going off. You get black Scottish people as well. 
I once did a tour, we played in Dumfries, and we're like, sound checked in afternoon, cool, let's go for some food, just going for a little roam around Dumfries, um, and literally, like, we're going to this Chinese restaurant, and the guy had a Scottish accent, and it really threw me off. Yeah. Like, yeah. It, it was a thickest Scottish yeah. accent. It, I'd, have under, I'd have understood him better if he were Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, brain now, like brain is sure struggling the, right now. I'm pretty sure the, the venue. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure the, the, the Jamaican president at one point was a white, white. dude. Yeah. And yeah. he has obviously like a proper Thick Jamaican, Jamaican accent. accent. And that like <laughs> Jamaica, Jamaica, yeah, Jamaica has like... a massive population of like Chinese immigrants too. Yeah. And you 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 can, go, you can literally go to like Jamaica and see a Chinese Jamaican guy accent. speaking Jamaican. Yeah. Yeah. Fall off. Yeah, yeah. Suck your mother about it, boy. Can I have a go? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what rhymes? Do you know what rhymes? <laughs> I'm actually quite good at doing accents. But it's fun while it lasted, guys. It's, 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 it's fun while it lasted. As, as soon as the camera's on, it's like, oh, this could go so wrong. So do quick. The, we do. <sighs> red, what do they call it? Like red, red light syndrome. I do love it. Like, red light fee. I love it. Like I love doing impressions and stuff like that. Though oh, it's no. like at least impressions you can kind of get away with a lot more. I, I don't know. You know. But don't try any of them just in case. No, I mean, like, not, not like imitating like, <laughs> accent, I mean, like, <laughs> impressions of, like, celebrities and stuff okay, like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I have my little party piece of the X Factor voiceover guy. That's me. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I go to Mackey's and just order it in his voice just to see if they get confused. And they're like, who's lost? <laughs> oh, I the, forgot the you showed us that on that tour. Just... I forgot. Oh, oh you got to do me a bit. Do me a bit. <laughs> no, I'm on the spot now. Like, Give him a subject. <laughs> so well, it's sometimes like if like if we like when I went Mackey's and I was just like, can I have? <laughs> <laughs> just went, can I have a large oasis? Nine <laughs> chicken McNuggets. <laughs> the did it, and the person deadpan went, "Is that all on your order?" <laughs> and I just went, I doubled down. I was just like, let me ask Rachel at a day <laughs> Just went, next window, please. <laughs> <laughs> they were so. They must have just been sick of their shit. Like, yeah, they're, they're shit. Like, I don't get a, get he's the, he's, he's the third cunt in a row. He's done that. <laughs> <laughs> Not even the first. <laughs> Are you all together, I was just like, what, the, what does she mean? What does she mean? It's just me. <laughs> I've gone round three times for the same order. <laughs> Another large oasis. Did you get like a large oasis? And a McChicken without the chicken or something he's in? Um... No, no, chicken McNuggets. No, what you use? A chicken get mayo. Like no oh. mayo. Yeah, but you get a chicken mayo. With no, no mayo. chicken. Yeah, right. I can't chicken, have an allergic to mayo. mayo. With no mayo. Oh, I'm allergic to mayo, but I ain't paying like double the price for a just, same burger. Just the fucking lettuce. <laughs> but he's only got enough of the bun. <laughs> All I I've, I've got my own bread. <laughs> Cheerio. I've got my bread. It's seeded. It's something just so funny about the tiny voice in the back of the van. Now everyone's ordering. Like, Excuse me, I can <laughs> yeah, right. It's because like the McChicken sandwich is like, like a little timid. Like, a... it's like no, a, it's because like the it's McChicken like sandwich is the exact same, except a little bigger, and it's like two packs. So it's not exact. Yeah. <laughs> now it is. They've changed the breading. It's just, it's just, it's, it's exactly the same but different. Yeah. Just, yeah. Simple, just a little the bit bigger. One's got mayo, I ain't gonna, see. yeah, I ain't gonna pay two pound odd for something I can get for like one pound odd. So I'm going to go for that one. And then just say, can I have a plain chicken Jeez, mayo, please? Only <laughs> 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 1.99, please. But I, they won't, they won't let 
thing is, though, I did try one day. I was like, can I have barbecue sauce instead of mayo? And they went, we can't put that through the till. And I was like, oh, okay, then I'll go fuck myself then, shall I? <laughs> Stop being awkward, just buy a real so I got, I didn't, bag. I didn't can't have mayo. I didn't want you to put it through the till, just pass it through the window. <laughs> 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 Why are you fuming? <laughs> Just stuck at the fucking buttons at the till, like I can't put that through the till. I'll get sucked. There's some woman punching the fucking bird. Can you just add me at them, please? I feel so sorry for them. Yeah. <laughs> it's like forty minutes in one of them waiting pits, and I'm just waiting for your food. <laughs> <laughs> See the police turn up, pulling this woman out, her hands are covered in barbecue sauce. <laughs> I tried, I'm really trying. Just barbecue sauce and lettuce, because that's all he wanted. <laughs> Didn't even want the chicken. <laughs> Have you seen the guy though? He Can was... I have a mayo? <laughs> the guy. Um, <laughs> just have a a <laughs> there was a dude though who went on like you know the self-service screen things, <laughs> and he ordered like a bur- like a, a like a Big Mac, but then just like t- turned everything off, and they he, they charged him, and then just gave him an empty box. Oh, what the hell? Wasn't it like forty odd quid or something as well? Because yeah, he made that many adjustments that it was like <laughs> what? No, you're on about the one who had everything. No, no, he got, the, he got given an empty box and got charged like a load of money because the adjustments costed the money. How is that? No, I, you know, like that, every time you that tweak makes... your order, it's like thirty p or a quid or whatever. Not if you take stuff away. Well, welcome I to tattoo. democracy. Hey, I, I tattoo a manager in Mackey's, and he's like nineteen, and he's a manager in Mackey's, and he's like, I'm sick of it. Now they come up to me like the staff members going, someone's asked me for a cheese. Said they're missing a cheeseburger. What should I do? And he's like. Give him a cheeseburger. <laughs> <laughs> like, why are you asking me these questions? <laughs> People do give stupid it's questions. Not, it's not though. the 1%. Just figure it out. I used to work in a farm <laughs> shop. And some of the questions I would get from like customers and that was the most stupid shit. One of them went, excuse me, are these Cypress potatoes local? And I was like... <laughs> and I just dead one was just like... Yeah, no. check where you are. <laughs> I was just like, no, the from Cyprus. <laughs> <laughs> and then they were like, oh, were these strawberries local? I was like, no, they're from, um, I was like, the Danish, because, like, you know, obviously not that time of season. And then she just went, I'm not having that foreign muck. Threw it away, but then got a curry pot afterwards and walked away. <laughs> and I'm like, to be fair, <laughs> curry, curry, curry is the best British invention there is. <laughs> or Indian food, isn't it? Oh, yeah, true. Yeah. Indian food is the yeah. best British export we have. Got to scorch that arsehole. Although... <laughs> you say that was so tame, like he wasn't, he didn't just say that, just like... <laughs> there was one... Got it, got it, got it. I'm in the loo, man. I'm Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm <laughs> He's putting a ciggy out. <laughs> New kink unlocked. <laughs> Just fucking scorch it, love. <laughs> Get a blowtorch on me bubble. Let's do this. <laughs> My nan will probably watch this. <laughs> Twice. <laughs> Speaking that of what f- fiery bubbles, <laughs> like, oh yes, me nan will watch this. No, no I don't mean like specifically Every, for that. It's weird, isn't it, how the brain links things? <laughs> yeah. That reminds me of it. To a certain memory. <laughs> You're, you're Talking right. about bum holes burning. Oh, I remember Uncle Charlie. No. <laughs> His house burnt down. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> Every day is a school day. No. Oh, Fucking hell. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> how the hell am I supposed to get on track? <laughs> Was there a track? No, not really. Well... <laughs> I, I, to be fair, like usually I do a little bit of prep before podcasts, and this is the only one where I thought I'm gonna be very, very loose on the, on the planning, and, and it's yeah. worked. <laughs> so yeah. Blow torched bubbles. Come in. Okay, <laughs> you just come in and you've just not been able to get anything back off them. You know, like what's your name? And they're like, yeah, Tim. Yeah. And then you've got to just like go, all right, and then just feed them. I don't know. I'm, all right. I, I'm terrible for just kind of filling gaps in conversation with people. I mean, 
I've not really had any chance today, which has been great, yeah. to be honest. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've loved it. We are known for chatting no, shit to, to, be, to be fair, I, I forgot that there were a podcast happening yeah. today. I was, just, I was just watching you. I feel like we might have as well, unfortunately. <laughs> 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 I think there were certain lines that we just drew it back. Yeah. We we kind of hung over them a bit. Yeah, but no, we're all right. We could but... get, get rid of down. them in post. It's fine. <laughs> Blue ball. And... It all stays. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> so I want I want because obviously you know you you're on road quite a lot. I want to know about some of your your favourite moments. Really, it can be it can be good or bad stuff. Okay. Wait, right, I've got one, <laughs> and it was fucking weird, and it's the one of the funniest <laughs> things I've ever seen. This is gonna be dead boring now. Just no, we were, <laughs> no, no. So we no. were at Winter Storm, and I was like, um, oh, it was like the after party type thing. So I'm chilling, and then this random, random Scottish guy just comes up to me, and he was just like, "Are you from um, England?" I was like, "Yeah," and I was like, "Oh, here we go. He's gonna kick off of me. I don't know what's going on here," because he said it quite aggressively, and then they just went, "Do you know who Jeremy Beadle is?" And I'm like, I know what you're yeah. And he was just, I said, showed you the video. <laughs> and then he was just like, well, I can summon the tiny hand of Jeremy Beadle. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm there like going, okay, but <laughs> uh, I'm intrigued now. <laughs> and he's just like, put 5p in my hand. And he's like holding it like this. And he's like, I watch the hand of Jeremy Beadle appear. So I put the 5p there. And this tiny little plastic hand appeared, takes the 5p and pulls it away. <laughs> Whoa. I was like, the fuck? And it killed me off for a good 20 minutes. And I still think about that to this day. <laughs> it's, it, it's so weird that you mentioned Jeremy Beadle because, like, it's, it doesn't really drop into conversation very often. But yeah, I, not... I was talking about Jeremy Beadle to my, to my wife yesterday. And I was Googling this clock that I'm sure existed that had a big hand and a small no. hand. No. And I said, I said, I'm said, I'm. I said it exists. Someone's made it, and I was trying to find it on Google Images to show her. I says, "Look at this because it's a renders," and I couldn't find it. And I'm like, "I have not just dreamt that up." You're gonna have to make one now. It sounds like it sounds like a chibs and thing. Yeah, like the, chib, the chibs and Jeremy Beadle signature clock. It's like the little. Hand, like... It's like got like he's got like, like the navy blue suit and it's just <laughs> and I'm like oh my god. Uh, I want one for me house. I, 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 I've amazing. definitely seen it somewhere. Some two year old in China's probably made one for Sheen. Yeah. <laughs> they did the they did the printout template of the Abu Hamza key holder with no, the hook. No. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> really? It's got his head and Lord's little horns. Oh. And then you hang the keys on it. <laughs> <laughs> Is that on Etsy or something? On Etsy. Okay. Right, I'm buying Shall that. I don't give a fuck. On the way over. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I make birthday cards and key holders. <laughs> Abu Hamza key holders. <laughs> Send me the link. <laughs> <laughs> we the, the best or worst of them. <laughs> we will. The worst was the real gig. Yeah. The where? Yeah. The real we gig. Played a gig real. We played a gig in real and we turned up and uh-huh. it's like. Oh, my. What's that? <coughs> oh my god! You found it! Found it. Pass, pass me that. <laughs> no fucking Don't check way. Search That's a thing. <laughs> Oh my god, it's real. <laughs> it is real. We might have to zoom it in on the on the camera a bit. But oh my god. I knew I didn't dream it. I know oh, I'm not dude. that sick. That's an, <laughs> that I'm not evil, it exists. <laughs> <laughs> Thank fuck. I'm so glad <laughs> I'm not a monster <laughs> for thinking that. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be really awkward if it didn't yeah. exist <laughs> and people think I'm a prick. <laughs> <laughs> They've definitely forgot about the Jamaican impression. Of <laughs> <laughs> you know, them little men in black, like little lights. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Off, you... off you fuck. <laughs> That never happened. <laughs> never happened. Unless he talks about the Beadle clock in a Jamaican accent. Oh, no. <laughs> never, never, never cross the stream. Nah, the real gig was awful. We turned up and, and we, we were like... It was supposed to be cancelled. And then well, the guy, it did get cancelled. He turned up anyway. And then, and then the guy was like, please, That's please, 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 can we reorganise it? And we were just like, we didn't really want to anyway. 
Because I don't know, you know some, did, some didn't feel right, but it was like a one that like a previous manager had booked and everything. It just wasn't something was off anyway. But he was like, "Please, I really want to do it." And we're like, "Okay, we'll we'll come doing it." And then he was radio silent for like three Lunch. months before the gig. The whole section, he'd not made any contact, didn't tell us about backline anything. We Nothing. found out later that he'd not been in touch because his laptop got nicked. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whatever the fuck that means. Like, oh, so you're not going to phone. But he had or... a phone. Yeah. yeah. But anyway, we got there and we were like, where are the monitors and stuff for the stage? And he was like, it's there. Like, it's Sing- there. Singular. It was like about that big, that big the whole monitor. For all, all I've five, done one of them. Five of us at the time, or was it? You know them? Yeah. They see the Roland cube behind you. you know, it was smaller than that. Half the size it's, of like, that. it's like that, but a wedge shape. <laughs> it was like pretty much that. And it was like, there's your, your monitor. And we didn't, we weren't on in, in ears or anything at that time. Oh, if we had a bean, we'd have just fucked off over. Oh, yeah. We were just like, and then he was like, oh, I've got another one, but it's in the next town over, but I can't get there. Can someone give me a lift to the next town over? I have to be just driven up like fucking five hours from somewhere else. So your dad had to go give him a lift to the next town over. I had to bring two extra tiny monitors and the leads. But his leads were broken for one of the monitors that he brought as well. And I can't even remember what happened the rest of it. I was just fuming. I was like, I can't speak to this man because I'm going to actually because the gig attack was, him. He didn't so like, they promote to... the gig anywhere either. Yeah. And then I remember, because I was like, oh, I'll try and drum some people up. And I went downstairs to the the bar, and it wasn't a rock bar in the slightest. It was weird. It was like a night club. It's in real. Yeah. Oh, and I was yeah. like, oh, we're, um, I was like, we're playing a gig upstairs, if, you know, if anyone wants to come to the show. It was and like a school them, disco. It was weird. And one of them just went, it's not that goth shit, is it? <laughs> like, <laughs> you are clearly Maybe. not our audience, but yes, it's it like, is. Well, we're in drop D. <laughs> <laughs> does that, does that count? Yeah. <laughs> it's, like, it's, it's like a meme, isn't it? It's not that goth the shit. The drop D. Yeah. <laughs> when you first discover drop D, and it's like the hand going like that. <laughs> I saw a thing, and it was like, um, how'd you tune into drop D? And someone just went, the big string goes bow. down, bow. Yeah. <laughs> just written bow. <laughs> and it was like, that is super accurate. When you hear it, you'll know. Yeah. Because all the stars will lie at once. Like, oh, I never have to play a fucking chord again. <laughs> <laughs> the yeah, people at the beginning with no fingers that can now play it. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we literally did all that faff and went through all that headache to play to about five people. And like two yeah, of them came with us, so it was just like fucking shit. But it, yeah, I don't I know. Did there was sign loads that just ass, went. Though. Did you? Yeah. It just went completely wrong, and the sound was awful. Like actually hear a thing. awful. <laughs> you, yeah, you couldn't hear anything. It was just mush. But <clears throat> I was fuming. They were like, "Just give Jess the the one baby speaker or something at yeah. the back, and they they all share the other we'll, small we'll, one. We'll figure it out." <laughs> and like all the lights were just red but dim, so like nothing. Like, you couldn't see anything. Oh no, it was like on dots, or off, wasn't it? It was spotlight. So it <laughs> yeah, it was just on like or off. That was it. It was funny on your eyes as well. Like yeah. it was just weird. But, yeah. yeah, I'm I'm like cautious of anybody that approaches me now for like new new venues. If I've not if I've not heard of it or someone decent yeah. that I know has played it recently, I'm like, mm. yeah, oh, yeah, and then yeah. I start being that guy like, well, oh, can I have a te- <coughs> can I have a text spec, please? Yeah. yeah, and they're like. Oh, Look at this pretentious prick. Yeah, yeah, I hate that. I think people are going to start thinking we're a bit Is not me. A bit But a... you've got to make sure because we don't want to turn up and then for some reason they can't accommodate and uh, they've promoted it, people yeah. have bought tickets and then they, you can't And then you play. sound terrible. Yeah, yeah. because... Or we, we can't do the gig because we can't, like, hear. We just if keep... you think you're having a tech spec makes you pretentious, though, then don't open a fucking venue. Yeah. <laughs> it's 2024, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. like... See, my friend's got a venue and <clears throat> it's on the website. There's a section where there's like tech spec yeah. of everything. Yeah. Yeah. Just, it should be see standard. What, yeah, this is the stuff that comes with it. And if you require more, they can hire in. But yeah. even then, he's got like ridiculous amounts of yeah. stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. As soon as we tell people we've got in ears, it's like they go, <gasps> yeah, that and they don't know never what to wrap do. me head around that. Have like, you found yeah. that? Yeah, because you've switched over. You've turned up to venues and tell the sound guy you've got in ears, and they're like, <laughs> <laughs> well, like when we do like the rock set tribute. It's just a box that comes, and they just get a feed, yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. and it's all controlled by us. So we, yeah. we, we're just self-contained. They just get a feed from that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Can you and control your own it. mix and everything? Yeah, yeah. We, we want to do that. And then, the but time. then with firing, every, everybody else likes to have, apart from obviously Josh, because we now play to click, so yeah. he's got in ears. I've always had in ears. Majority of the time, I've been with firing probably. 
like 10 out of the 11 years that I've been yeah, with them. Because yeah. no. uh, they're quite loud. So after a year in, I thought, I need to do something. Or, yeah, I'll, yeah. or I've got a year left of gigging in me. Yeah. <laughs> for my years giving. And uh, mine's just really simple. It's like, I have a mic on stage that picks up the stage sound and I turn that up and down. Yeah. <laughs> and then another one that's my radio mic that goes in and I turn that up and down. So I just basically turn down stage noise and me. Yeah. And sound men, you look at them and the, the, the certain guys just go, oh, that's great, that's nice and easy and I ain't got to drive the monitor so I'm able to push you out front and all that. And then you get other ones like, they start trying to make it really complicated and talk about random things and they're trying to plug into stuff. I'm like, well, no, no, don't touch that. Says, you just literally just, as if I had a radio mic. Yeah. And if it ain't broke, don't fix yeah. it. Yeah, mm-hmm. as if I had a radio mic and that, you, but you don't have to worry about my monitors because yeah. I do it myself. I just, people just seem horrified like when it, they've got a monitor and I go, oh, I've just got in I'm like, what about my quad stack of speakers? Oh. Why don't you want to use them? It's like, because you've got a click coming through them and you've got to blast the click through your speakers to my ears. It's we, not backup, but you just take out We did a gig at a KK, out the band we gig with will go unmentioned, but <laughs> everyone else obviously know what about. <laughs> uh, we played a gig at KK's in, in the smaller room in KK's. Um, during the sound check, obviously, you know, like, just for transport and ease sake and packing up and down and consistency, etc. Like, me, Paddy, and at the time, you know, Non Roland. Um, non Roland. Uh, you, you were using like mod- modelers. Um, non like, Roland. Roland's, Roland's predecessor. Yeah, yeah, the we one we had to feed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, we, you know, we, we all use like modelers and we, so we were struggling no to get. Line. Yeah, there was like literally no backline. We were struggling to get it. Well, like, we were struggling to get a good sound from the sound okay. guy's end of it. And um, I think. It, we, we stopped and we like we, we kept asking for levels to be adjusted and you know we were tweaking and we just couldn't get a good sound and he, the guy the sound guy for the record was like 95 and a half mm. and he was like the problem with you is you don't have a back line he's like well it's 2023 you've clearly been doing it since the 70s you should be updating your methods as technology advances it's like but that it was more like work, like anymore. quick but it's not, soundtrack. It's not it wasn't that like m- us being faffy. Yeah. You know, you go, can I have a bit more of the uh, lead singer and a bit more guitars? But he couldn't get it and he was he like, you know, he's, he's, like, like he's like, I just can't get a good sound out of It's not that new though, is it? Because no, it's no. like, and, and even still, like people are using that stuff like, you know. They're using, 20 they, years ago. Yeah, they're using yeah. stuff in late 90s and stuff like that. Some stuff, obviously majority, it sounded crap, but you've got a few little gems every now and then. And and people would take a feed from that. and. You just dealt with your sound on stage, and then sound as man would have that. Yeah, so so it's not new. Enough, he then. was adamant. He was adamant that we sounded shit out front because we didn't have a wall of marshals behind us. And it was like, dude, like we you're played all the gigs idiot. where this is not the case, <laughs> inside and outside. As that. Like you're yeah. just a fucking idiot. You yeah. <laughs> We weren't that attitude first, though. It was only that after he started having a go at everyone, he was like shouting at me, Dad. He was shouting at us. He yeah. was yeah. kicked off. And like, like big, uh, uh, Joe, like he probably nothing, kicked off. Yeah, yeah. He, he was an arrogant. He was an arrogant arsehole, basically. <laughs> anyway, Karma kicked his ass because when it got to Steelhouse, the band he was sound teching for, he blew the fucking PA at Steelhouse, didn't he, during the set? So <laughs> all the like, cut that shit like... out, bro. Like the whole thing just went. <laughs> just he, turned off. And he, apparently he, they had to wait for the PA to reboot. Yeah, and he pressed like some like. You know, you know, the off, big, the big red it, off button, and then he like yeah. fucking slipped on it, and <laughs> everything just died. And so they had like th- three or four songs cut out. Uh, I felt like, so sorry for the band. Like, like, the problem is, yeah. you've, you've got backline this time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine like, the other way. Around. That's why it fucked. <laughs> <up>. <laughs> See, I'm up to date now. <laughs> Yeah. Um, doesn't it, it feel so good though when you've got like the stars aligned you've got that that sound engineer that is with you not yeah. against you yeah. oh my god because you get them on place. sometimes it's like you've come into their house and they're angry yeah. at you that you're even there yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I can remember I can't remember what the venue's called but I played a is it Ashton under Lynn or something it's called or Line I don't know line, yeah. is that it yeah I don't know I don't know I've just, only ever read it I, I just <laughs> typed it yeah that's it I, I didn't stick around so uh, <laughs> But I got there, and it was like Carl Pilkington were doing sound for us, like yeah. everything were asshole. And he was, he, he were yeah. like, That's when I mentioned my like. my setup, and he he just like looked at me, and he were like, I says, oh, you just got to take a feed from that. It's just XLR to to this, and he'd, he'd already set me a line mic up before I got there, and he just went <sighs> like that, <laughs> and didn't say anything to me, and yeah. just walked off. 
to go and get another cable. You feel like, sorry. I, like, uh, majority sorry. of the time, you know like when you play like festivals that are indoor and it's just, yeah. you haven't got yeah. time to mess about. It's no. line check, yeah. go. Yeah. Sometimes yeah. you don't even get a line check. It's just, just yes. start. So I, I, phenomenal. I just go straight up to that lead bike, <clears> unplug <throat> it, and yeah. just walk over and plug it into my little box and it's crack on. Yeah. Because they're going to get something like, anyway. Were you really worried about... Um, when we played Call of the Wild last year, cause I think that was the first gig we, we were going to use a sample of that. And, and it we, is. And we and he and he is, yeah, it was all like completely fresh. Trial festival fresh, halfway yeah. up the bill. So oh, it was like, he was at a festival, is that? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It was, it was so scary. Scary. Like, we could not have picked it was like the worst. Five p fifty p all day. Like this, yeah. is <laughs> <laughs> this is either going to be yeah. fucking <laughs> awesome or utter shit. New songs, first time in everything. And we yeah. turned up, and the guys were just like, "Ever is your packs." All ready to go. Just plug your ears into them, and then it's like, all right, let's say you, oh, you, you, you bang, bang, bang. Five minutes it took, and it was like, oh my so god, I can hear everything. It, it, it was like it was, it was beautiful, amazing, liquid. Yeah. Yeah. When well, you get people who know what they're doing, doing, and it's yeah. just, it's Lots just good. amazing. Yeah. Like, and that's what you know. God. You're like, well, it can't be us because if they just <laughs> used our stuff and got it spot on like that, like, yeah, nothing's just, changed. So they're either amazing or they're so angry. Yeah. Remember, remember that one guy? Like, I ended up kicking off at him because I hold my mic a certain way because I've got like a thing called BET where my whole body shakes, so my hands all shake, so I hold You're it. Laughing at him, way. poor bro. Wow. <laughs> He's like, I'm. I've got some so I hold, with me. Joe's like, <laughs> yeah. So I hold it a certain way, and then it's like I don't have like an omnidirectional mic. It's coming that way, so mm. like it's not cupping really. It's like one finger slightly over just to help me like not shake it. Stabilize. Yeah, and. As I come after on homecoming, you know, during the thingy, sound guy comes up to me and starts grabbing my hands, going, This is how you hold the microphone. I was yeah. like, Get off me. And then he literally kept going and he was like, No, you're holding it. So I just pushed him. I was like, Get the fuck off me. And I was like, I will fucking floor you, you horrible little rat. Oh, yeah. I was sh- like, that's, I never fumed, but I was that's furious. That's crazy for someone to just come up to you and do that. Like, oh, yeah. yeah, that's like, I, I mean, like, told imagine, you, imagine if he was someone important. Yeah. yeah. What, like, Kyle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, I was just like, I'm gonna be dead. I went to him. I was, I was like, I literally was just like, it's. Uh, I was like, I hold it that way because of me, me fucking disability, you little prick. And then he was just like, after that, and then so I went, went as I came off and like speak to the promoter, and I was fuming, and like he was just like, what? And I was like, yeah. So he was just like, no, nah, I'm not having that. Like they, no. the promoter, was sound about it, like because I told him because I was. Pure raging. Sounds like you're really upset. Uh, it was like. Sounds like a you problem. Yeah, it was. <laughs> <laughs> like, I've never yeah. had that before. Like, this is how you're meant to hold it. And I was just like, ah, shut up, you fucking gimp. You've never, mo- you've never moaned about being touched before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but when it comes to holding me microphone, it's different. Although no, that, no, that, that is like, like for someone to literally come up and start yeah. grabbing your hand and going like, no, this is how you do it. It's like, yeah, yeah. fuck off. Bullshit, it's like, are you, it's like, no, let me hold it my own way. I'm not, I'm, it's not as if I'm holding it like this. Going, yeah. Like, I get that. You never had an issue on the gigs we did together. Yeah, like, no yeah. issue. I, I get it. So it's like, I'll, I'll use the same gear everywhere I go. And I've had it for nearly 10 years, that setup. And then like one in 50 gigs, someone will go, well, as I start line checking it, they'll go, what mic is that? And I'm like, oh, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Someone that doesn't know what they're doing. He wants to blame me. Yeah. Not bad. <laughs> I've done it for 50 years. I've never had this problem before. Yeah. You know what? This like... vocalist, if he had a fucking Marshall, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. we'd be fucking... You've got no backline. That's your problem. <laughs> Can you turn your symbols down, please? <laughs> oh. <laughs> that reminds me of the to turn your symbols down, please. Someone's I was. Better. I was doing some <laughs> session work as a drummer for um, Abandono, and the lovely, <laughs> he's, I'm trying to word this. Is he's this a, the one he's a, he's a little butties. bit insane. <laughs> like, lovely, but I love him to bits. He's a toy <laughs> short of a happy meal. And uh, <laughs> he just went to me, he went, can you turn the tinniness down of your cymbals? <laughs> And I didn't know what he meant. I was like, what? He was just like, your cymbals sound a bit tinny, can you like turn them down? So we just kind of, Twisted the, 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 the top of it, and he went, "Yeah, that's better." I was like, okay. "Like, oh, okay." Yeah, I've uh, I've had a few few people on uh, previous episodes who've done like club circuit and stuff like that. Yeah. They know exactly what you're on about. It's that kind of people asking drums to be quieter when they're not even through PA. Like, they literally just they'll just set it up because drums drums are like set up, and everybody else is set up, and he's still. Dicking around with PA and stuff, and they'll just a quick little run through of it all, and just and then they just go, oh, that's too loud. 
I'm like, well, you're in for a shock in 10 yeah. minutes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not even took PA on yet. Yeah. Yeah. One... Goodbye, your rib cage. Uh, yeah. was like, one... like, do you want to go get me some brushes there yeah. for our, fucking, oh, for, I, for our I goth set? I remember another bad moment oh, when no. we played. Well, it doesn't matter which venue does it. Nothing to do with the venue. But there was a support a band that was supposed to be on first, oh, who was the local band. I don't know where you're going. And um, we were he- we were headlining. Oh. There was a support band and a f- the first band on. Oh. And um, yeah, we told yeah. everyone like bring your own breakables because oh, yeah. people people <laughs> break stuff all the time. They're called breakables, aren't they? It's like we're the headline band. You can use Michelle's. It's absolutely just standard fine. to bring them, isn't but it? You bring shouldn't be your told. Sticks, bring your cymbals. Bring your stands. You know, your breakables, your seat, your pedals. And the band had been told directly by one person and the promoter twice because I said to him, I was like, it just makes you feel awkward. I hate it when bands come up to me and go, can I use it? Because I'm like, I look like a knobhead if I say no. But I don't want you to use the stuff because I, I can't replace it if you yeah. know if you break it. Or you, have you got the cash on you right now? Yeah, to, to fix it if you break it or lose parts. Or, you know, people always losing like clutches or everything. Yeah, and just... that's happened to us. Yeah, it, Losing yeah. them in their own fucking symbol yeah. bag that they've run out to bring. <laughs> Literally. So anyway, he told everyone, um, the other band who were playing, lovely guys, you know, we turn up five for the sound check. Everyone's supposed to be there at five. I think the doors opened at seven. The first band on who were local hadn't even turned up yet for sound check. So the second band had to go on first. They turned up about 20 minutes into their set, loading all their gear in, like through the crowd. All I'd have just said, have well, complete silence or have background music on. Let, let the second band play in yeah. their allocated slot. Literally. You play. And the other guys, if they missed it, they Tough exactly. tip, mate. No, so they they loaded in, that's the thing. There's, and then, a, there's lesson one. And yeah. then this, this guy comes up to me, because I think someone said, I must have pointed him to me, and he was like, are you the drummer? And I was like, yeah. And he was like, I'm using all your kit, yeah. And I went, no. I was like, no, you've been told to do that. And he was like, but I can't do it. And he basically started having a go at me, telling me he was going to use it. And I was just like, I'm really sorry. Like, they probably live like 10 minutes away anyway. And um. He kicked off and he was going to the promoter, shouting and everything. I got that upset because they're like telling people no. So I was just like, oh, but oh, I did. He's been not- <laughs> <laughs> that's not off really, not you know. If, 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 they, yeah. if they come along and it's reasonable, like, it's just like, oh, you've accidentally yeah, misplaced like, one, yeah, thing like or you know, we, we were just about set off and then my auntie collapsed in front of us in the living yeah, room, yeah, fair yeah. enough. But, but like when you because- miss, you don't come to sound check, you miss your slot, you're loading in through the crowd, you're in the other band slot, come up and you tell me you're using my kit. I was like, Really sorry, not even no. apologise for being late. No, 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 no. Fuck no, no. all of that, mate. It's like, that. I'm using your kit, end of. And then yeah. it's like, and no, I just said, and then mean, no. they, they had to leave. Cause Most bands are really play. nice, really helpful, yeah. really accommodating. Everybody just gets along because we're all just. We're all this little breed, aren't we? Yeah, you know, yeah. we've got this own little weird humour. Yeah, the fucking yeah, there, there sadists. No... <laughs> <laughs> Sadomasochists. And you just get these ones that's like, they shouldn't really be... They're, 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 not, they're not actually I'm part of a community. If you, are no, they? you live ten minutes away and you can't get your drum kit to the venue that's ten minutes away, you shouldn't be in a band. Not even your full yeah. drum kit. Like, just fuck the yeah. and don't come out the house. Even if you didn't have a car and you lived ten minutes away, you could definitely get your drum kit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. someone yeah. would help. I mean, they got there somehow, didn't they? And the rest of them brought it. But then they had to go home because they couldn't play because their drummer didn't bring any drum stuff. And they properly made, they properly made <laughs> it was, out like it's all it was, their Yeah, fault it was that like my fault it's that like, they can't play. Fuck you, bro. Like, you... <laughs> what? Well, uh, yeah, it's like... Simple. <laughs> Suck <Yeah>. your mother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, do the accent. <laughs> <laughs> Don't half arse it. Oh, no. I, I think... I think uh, Suck your mother, Batty Boy would be pretty good in um, uh, Britain's Got Talent. Boys. Yeah. <laughs> big... What was it? Suck your mother, Batty Boy. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm, it's gonna be I'm just gonna put fifty p in jukebox. Yeah. <laughs> 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 trying... Oh wow, well, the pressure's on it. I know. Yeah. Suck your mother, Batty Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely going to be my new ringtone. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sampling that for text messages. <laughs> my phone's been on silent for eight years. And, uh, it's coming on for that. Yeah. <laughs> you can't get that anywhere. A special one just for Podcast that. exclusive. Oh. I'm one of them. I'm one of them. I never have me. F- I vibrate is the most I have my phone on. Yeah. And that's a special occasion. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, I, I, I just, I don't know, when I hear my phone ring or my text goes, bing, like it, it triggers like a rage. Uh, like, I, uh, I, I hate, you know, like when you're in public and someone's got like a, a really generic ringtone yeah. and they don't know it's their phone ringing. <laughs> yeah. And they're like, uh, answer your phone, please. <laughs> please. <laughs> please. And they're just carrying on doing what they're doing. You, <laughs> what do you mean? No. It reminds me of that. Do you remember that advert? Uh, what, what? It was a phone advert. And it was like, ashamed of your mobile. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Anytime you had like a shit ringtone, you used to just shout, ashamed of your mobile. As <laughs> if they got to that point where they were doing mobile shaming now. <laughs> I genuinely remember, like, I'd worked with someone. You and she was just like, And she was like, if they don't have an iPhone, I don't speak to them anymore. You're like, I've she was like, how she, iPhone. like, if she was like on Tinder and she was like, get the number. She's like, if it's not an iPhone, I'll ghost them. And no, I'm no, that, like, that's, wow. that's, that's someone who doesn't really know what they want and is wasting <laughs> their own time. That's just a psychopath. Yeah. Like, uh, that's, uh, that's nutty, that. Do you, do you have an Android? Yeah, well, you are scum. That's why I buy Androids. <laughs> Whenever I see someone with an iPhone, it's always smashed to bits. Like, yeah. I've never yeah. seen one without a crack screen. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure that comes as standard. Yeah, yeah. They look like, been shoved like when you buy ripped jeans. Yeah. <laughs> it's the ripped got jeans the, got of the, the mobile phone. 60 quid yeah. more, but it's cracked. <laughs> Relic. Really? It's, a relic. <laughs> it's a Murphy Lab aged iPhone. It's, it's already got pocket fluff in the charging <laughs> port. <laughs> this is the fucking blues. Steve lawyer. Jobs belly button fluff just <laughs> This is charging well, not port, anymore. Man. Like, but no, like well. this is the blues lawyer edition iPhone. No. It comes with a brown. Do you remember when everyone brown, a brown case with yeah. pink fluff? <laughs> I love that. Everyone was like, what do you mean you don't have a Blackberry? Yeah, but like, BBM, like, I remember that was like oh, year every six. Little, every BBM. little gimp had BBM, bro. <laughs> oh. They got rid of that because that's what, didn't they use that for the riots to communicate when they started? I don't think so. Yeah, yeah, like, they, they were, yeah then they were doing it in Birmingham and stuff and people were just like smashing loads of <laughs> like electronic cool, shops in and stealing hot TVs and, and then all the best planning. thing it was used for oh. to be it honest. is really because yeah. like all, all, the, all the other stuff it was getting done it was probably like 21 year olds asking 13 year olds yeah. for pictures yeah, yeah. Yeah. or just executives cheating on the wives yeah. 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 BBM was like the, like the precursor to Snapchat yeah. Yeah. and now they use it for riots like, oh. I saw that there was a thing though when the riots were happening there was like people looting someone looted like an entire bag of rice you know like the massive <laughs> huge ones that are like I this big I remember seeing that picture <laughs> I, 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 I just running is, away with this big ass I bag of rice I can understand that more than a TV though yeah, yeah. the well, rice so, will outlive yeah, the yeah. telly yeah. Someone, it's like the fact you that you rice is good telly, it just blew my mind that there was a, it wasn't like there was a bit yeah. where it wasn't like the big expensive ones it was like they looted Poundland B&M <laughs> <Yeah>. like, like, <laughs> Okay, all these one stuff. pound headphones. Yeah. Yeah. There's an Uncle Ben shortage in fucking. <laughs> it's just the fact, like, uh, it's it's like they get regularly shoplifted all the time. Anyway, I used to, when I used to work in like um like a, an electronic store. I won't say which uh, due to you know Why? I don't want to get sued. He's NDA. That was on four years. No, no, but like the MDNA. amount of people that would come in. He's got like rectangular shaped coat every time he walks out. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. Even... That's all me. <laughs> they'd come in and they bit Jim, <laughs> and they'd be like, "Oh yeah, I could have traded this in," and they'd be like. Uh, like a clearly stolen Bluetooth speaker from BNM. Oh, I know where you're on about. And then they just keep coming in like every oh, day God. with the same one. They'd be like, oh, yeah, my nan just keeps buying me them. Like, yeah. okay. <laughs> sound I'm convinced, lad. I she, might have, she might have been a bit. <laughs> <laughs> she, oh, thanks for the up. She's really gone downhill. She it's my birthday every week. Oh, our Jack would love this. <laughs> <laughs> same again next Friday. But then um, there, was, oh, there was one guy as well. He wanted to sell. Some earphones to us, yeah. and they were caked I, in yeah. earwax. <laughs> yeah. Caked in I earwax. Used, I used to work in game, and people are trying to trade oh. in like brown controllers yeah. because they're just like you know all around the edges of the just controller. Brown on a corner. It's all brown there, all around the buttons, all around uh, the edges in the gaps, and it's like. You drop it. No, the... you can't do that. Yeah, 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 like, I feel like, like should, I should, shouldn't even be handling this. Yeah. Should I was a hazmat yeah. suit. It's well, that bad. Here you go. <laughs> they, they pass it to you and the controller smells and you've literally got it over there and you've already brought how, it over and you're like... They, well, they, smell? they drop... How they they, they put the... They put the what's in yeah. the earphones on the table, and I mean, like, when he put them, the earwax fell off a bit and they were still hanging <laughs> on. And I'm there going... Yeah. 
And I was like, I went, we can't bring these in. And he just went, well, where's it say on your website? They have to be clean. <laughs> like, it's just basic hygiene, mate. No, and he was proper. I want to speak to your managers. Sam, my managers, like, we're not taking these in. Yeah. That, but that's not the worst. Someone traded in, like, the, Donkey Kong Country returns for the Wii. I remember this to this day because I am traumatized. <laughs> I, and they were like, yeah, yeah, could I trade in Donkey Kong Returns for the with Nintendo Wii? I'm like, yes, yeah, certainly. Open it. Use Johnny Falls out and hits the oh, table. Oh, bro. I'm like, I was like, no. I was did, like, it, did it have glaze in it? It was, it was, yeah. used? It was a used. And I'm just like, I just passed him and went, we are not trading this item in, please. And they were just like, why? And the I'm like, mm, that... it's covered in cum. Like, <laughs> Why did you put it there? The thing I is, don't you, know. You can't use their logic against them because if you turn around to them and said, we can't take this in because, like, imagine you found that on the shelf and you're like, oh, can I buy this, please? And we opened it and had a used Johnny it's in a it. Children's you wouldn't game fucking though? buy it, would you? And no. half of them would be like, yeah, 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 it would. Yeah, they just say it. Well, uh, well. The thing is, who goes, oh, you know what? Finish, finish me bang. Whip the condom off. Maybe he wasn't supposed to. You know to. what? Maybe wait, someone wait, came wait, in, in dead it? quick and he, the, f- the closest thing was just a box. I've got, a, I've got a perfectly good bin there. Uh, uh, get, the, get the donkey Kong <laughs> look. It was the, 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 the hey, disc even in the there. The lads in the shop will find this fucking hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. Steven loves that game. <laughs> I just want to get shouted at all the time for games that didn't exist. Like, wo- oh. or some woman asking for, like, Super Mario Sunshine on the Xbox 360. That and I was like, so you don't well. have it. it. It doesn't exist. It's not on that console. It is. I've seen it. My kid wants it. I've seen it. I was like, no, it does exist. You can get and it I want on. a Jeremy Beedham <laughs> clock. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, you can get this one on this console or this for this. And they're like, no, it's that one. It's because you don't know what I'm talking about. You don't know what I'm talking about. And you just think. Yeah, yeah, I oh, don't know what you're talking about. about. In the end, you just go, yeah, I don't know what I'm talking about. So you okay, boomer. Yeah. <laughs> there, was, there was one where I did fully cause a fight. Like, I caused the he couple... He fights. The dude. couple started, like, she fully hit him in the face, and oh, I man. felt awful. Because he traded his phone in, but he had screen burn. And usually, <laughs> oh, screen burn, you just thingy. But the top of it, the screen burn was freesexchat.com. Oh. And I'm like, I can't sell, sell this. <laughs> and he would just went, I can't sell it. It's screen burn. He went, why? And I was like... Burn. There's a porn when you leave, site. When you leave, like, when you leave your screen on something for too long, <laughs> when you turn the screen off, it always burns. He's and got a phone in one hand and Donkey oh, Kong in other. <laughs> it's like, it's like a different guy. So if you had like Facebook open and put your fo- bro- phone on full brightness and then left it, up, you know, you set it to where it can't lock for and weeks. just left it open for like two days, weeks. you'd turn your phone off and you'd still be able to see the Facebook thing. Oh, old oh, school right. TVs yeah, used phone. to do that. Yeah, if you yeah, pause yeah. the DVD and yeah. then people would kick off and be like, no, get up, get up. Guess they're going to be like, there's going to be somebody off Coronation Street on <laughs> yeah, screen forever. Roy Crop is there forever. Yeah. Just permanently yeah. on the I don't know why I'm thinking of that on a DVD. <laughs> Who's got Coronation Street on DVD? They do, they do have like specials on DVDs. Like, you can get the one with the big tram crash on DVD and stuff like that. <laughs> You're all literally a pensioner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, it's just we used to sell them. He's watched it. So, uh, yeah, so they're, they're the worst gigs we've ever done. <laughs> um, so, <laughs> but yeah, well... To finish the story that quick. Yeah. So I was just like, can't because you've got free sex chat.com. And she went, What's that? And I was like, Well, it's clearly a sex chat, <laughs> it, yeah. sex it, chat it, site. It, I'm you sorry. could not title something with yeah. a more descriptive title. <laughs> <laughs> and she full on punched him in the face. Like, fair, fair play to be fair. Like, like, it was it understandable. Yeah. And I'm just... into his screen as well. That's like a regularly. Yeah. And they, they kicked off. It was a big fight. And then they stormed off and they left the phone. Yeah. And I'm like, can't sell this. Yeah. Like, what did we do? I guess I'll in just take it over. Yeah. <laughs> What's that website again? Done... <laughs> yeah, we have done great gigs too. Yes. Yeah. We, <laughs> <still> <laughs> are... we derail so and much. And we like them. Yeah. We like them. They're really good gigs. Steel House. It's why we, it's why we do we it. Had, so like... We had a, a slot at 11 in the morning on a Sunday for oh, Steel House. For so it we were graveyard. like a well, little bit but worried, there, but... but we got there earlier. Like the, so we spent like the Saturday, Friday and Saturday there and we went round everyone. We were like, we're playing on Sunday morning. Please come see us. We're really good. Probably. Um, and we're nice people, so please come and be away. Not and arrogant at all. <laughs> no one, no one like, came. <laughs> don't be hanging. No, we were just friendly to everyone. We were just mingling and telling everyone where we were and blah, blah, blah. And it was like three minutes before we went on and there was like two people outside and we're thinking, oh, fuck, like no one's going to watch it. And then as soon as like we started the set, 
like the intro came on or whatever, like loads of people, like little bugs from under a rock just came out and it, yeah. and it filled it filled up. Filled wow. it? Was like, like three or four thousand people in the space of like a minute and a half yeah. just appeared. Yeah. It's like, we holy were, fuck. We were on the side of the stage, just a bit like disheartened. And we were like, you know what? We tried so we were, hard. We were like, the 20 people that are here. Like Let's fucking show, give them a yeah. show and a half. Let's let them figure out what they've missed out. So yeah. we were like fully like, oh, this is 20 people. But fuck it. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah. Get I off stage. You... And we were like, where the fuck have all these people come from? And it was one of the wildest as gigs. We, as yeah. we started, I remember we started with fighting for, our, for, for, for my life back then. Yeah. Yeah. That was the kicker off. That was the kicker off. If you, want. you could, if you looked out straight, you could see people like rushing to get to Running. the stage. Prior to, prior to that set, a lot of people have been saying like, "Oh, we're looking forward to you guys. You know, we're gonna. We, we've told all our friends we need to see. We need to catch you. Like, we can't miss you." But you know, it, it was a Sunday as well. It was the like, first literally. first slot on a Sunday. And everyone's been, been there for two. Yeah, everyone's been there for two days. It's been pissing it down the weekend. Everyone's been getting pissed, hanging out their ass. It's dead nice weather for us. We didn't really expect the turnout because of the slot, but it was. It was jump packed. Back. It was awesome. And we had the longest so queue of merch for the whole weekend, whole weekend. they said, didn't they? Everyone we, who we, was we selling merch. We, out, we literally outsold every band in merch that on that day, on Sunday, and that included Europe. For but I, d- I don't know if everyone mad. had merch. Did Not they have ever. merch? I don't know. Oh. Well, hey, we were just like, merch, we yeah, yeah, we, yeah. We were like, and Europe but why us? Like, we, it blew our minds because we, they, we they said, oh, do you want to do the meet and greet? I'm like, yeah, yeah, fine. Think it again. Be a couple of people. We're going to be like, like the birthday party with the kid where no one turns up. We're just going to be sitting there like, yeah. Yeah. Just sat there going, no, I didn't want to sign anything. But they had to cut the queue short and they had to stop people joining the queue. It was dead weird. But yeah. it was really cool. We were just like, why? Why? Like, what? It's only us. Like, yeah. what the hell? We're just some It was some like fellas. that taste of like, like, Rock star yeah, and it was yeah. just like, and then it was just like a drug. You're like, give us more. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was, it was just, it was great. That it was so good. I got given a leg. Was Joran, it Molly's leg? Yeah, Joran. Um, Have he been given his leg twice? Twice, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like if I was given a pound for every time I've been given a wooden leg, well, prosthetic leg on stage, it'd be kind of two quid, <laughs> which doesn't sound like a lot. <laughs> it doesn't sound like a lot. Two quid it's more, more than me. But it's interesting that it's happened twice. I haven't been given a fake ear before. A you fake get a fake ear? I've not ear. had a fake ear. Mm. Have you seen Robin Hood Men in Tights? Yeah. He goes, gentlemen, <laughs> lend me your ears. Like... <laughs> we'll have to like, do like, kind of like, your Take bingo off card. Take body part. Yeah, yeah. see, what, what, have you, what have you had today? Oh, I, I can't wait. I've given a, a, a wooden arm. In your mouth. A prosthetic. <laughs> what? Yeah. A prosthetic. <laughs> it, was, it was dead funny though. Phallic organ. Someone just, who keeps throwing dildos on stage? I can't wait until someone throws a knob at your mouth. I wait at you and it goes in your mouth. <laughs> just a leaky, a leaky flashlight on stage. A leaky? Why is it leaky? Because it's been used. Some guy, some, some guy just tries to trade it in, probably. <laughs> yeah. You didn't say it has to be clean. Excuse me. <laughs> who said it has to be clean? Excuse me. Does this, set, does this flashlight have signs of use and cum? Uh-huh. <laughs> Why is it dead sticky? <laughs> I feel like that's gotta be a really sad time cleaning yeah. out or something like that. You know what I mean? Like you'd hate oh, yourself. You? <laughs> that's like gross. Isn't or it? them like <laughs> them plastic thing, <laughs> the 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 woman thing. The yeah. flashlight. Yeah. No. Don't we, pretend you don't know what. It's no, I don't. No, I don't know what <laughs> they're. they're like, I know what they're called. It's like a can, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Like, 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 like a the, the one that's oh, like the it's like a full yeah. backside yeah. and front yeah. end. Yeah. 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 Who had one of them? We didn't see it in real life, but he posted his OnlyFans. Who did? And Some someone we know was sub to it and sent us a screenshot. And I was like really confused, first of all, because he said something about it being nine kilograms and doing stuff with it. And I was like, is he doing? Is you probably like kid. Nine kilograms isn't that heavy. And then I realized it was obviously like a torso because I was like, we were literally Googling, like, what's nine kilograms in stone? Yeah. <laughs> <we're> British, <laughs> like, he's like, hang on. He's like, he's just put, he's just posted this publicly that he's about to fuck his nine kilogram oh, whore. Oh, yeah. no. And I was like, oh no. This, oh no. This is, literally, those this are the is words. horrible. Please. Checking out the average age for BMI. Like, yeah, like, like, only <laughs> fans. <laughs> You promised you wouldn't tell anybody. You know it's like got no head Could have been a midget. Like, like, uh... It was literally just like a, a, a torso. It was yeah. a torso. It had no limbs. It was just a, like no. a body. That's all you need, isn't it? Really? <laughs> well, we, we we first we first like <laughs> discovered what they were like 15 years ago, no. and because they, they're not exactly like 
on telly are very often. No. You know, <laughs> QVC after that. Terry Tibbs. Yeah. <laughs> so we're talking about Feel it. the latex uh, inside. <laughs> at this barbecue, at this friend's barbecue, and he just, me and my friend Johnny, we were just sat, sat at this table, and, and he's, he just went, oh, yeah, he said, I had one of them when uh, me and my wife split up. There's like 30, you do. 30 people at this at this party. Oh, things, just things, got, things you don't say out loud. Got it out of the garage it and just the put it on the table in Did front of everybody. It, off? it weren't even clean. Bro. Not even joking. Dude. It was crispy. To, to be fair, like, what you do? Like, put it in a dishwasher or like. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, 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 I would imagine you just shower it. Like, put it in the like fairy liquid yeah. and stuff like that. Oh, God, it's getting a bit slack, this. Let's put it in the dishwasher. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he lived at home with his mum, still, this guy it's, we know as well. It's like, how are you hiding that? And he's like... got a missus and a kid now, and I think, I wonder if he's still got that somewhere. <laughs> it's the like, latex, in the house, the you know what I mean? Like, it's just like weird. Like, if she's ever seen that or knows that exists, like. I think people have really, really but... low points in the life, and I think that, like, <laughs> like that's, that's gotta, gotta be, be one that's, of gotta, the that's gotta, that's gotta be the ultimate L. Is just, just clean and one of them out after using it. It's, it's just... like when you don't, when you, you know, when you, how do you look at yourself? If you ever thought it's like enough this? to have mates who do weird shit, and then you get in relationships, but you know what weird shit they've done, yeah. and you're there just like. Yeah. No. I can't tell you. <laughs> Gotta tell him with the best man's speech. Yeah. What, 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 what I've not seen him for fucking years at this point. Like, he's, he's probably not going to listen, so it's fine. I'm fine to, I'm fine to recite the story. Okay. Throw <laughs> this dude under the bus. So, yeah. for, for he get get curbed. So, <laughs> so he start, I used to work at a cinema, right? And he started as a manager of the cinema about six months after me. He liked wrestling, so I like wrestling. So we were like, yeah, wrestling buds, whatever. And he was like, oh, you know, do you want to like wrestle? Yeah, yeah. let's wrestle. <laughs> <laughs> it's quiet. Yeah. <laughs> no one so, comes to cinema it's anymore. It's not gay. Yeah. Kiss. <laughs> you don't want to wait, wait till after work. <laughs> no, let's, let's do it now. Tom Tom bomb off the kiosk. <laughs> Popcorn <laughs> everywhere. Story, that one. <laughs> <laughs> so like, my mate's giving us a lift after work, and I'm, he goes to me, ah, "Well, you know, we can we can drop you off at yours if you want." He's like, "Yeah, yeah, Sam." It's like. You just want to come back and hang out for a bit. Um, you're welcome to. <laughs> so we're like, well, fuck it. We've got nothing else better to do. We might as well, you know. Like, so we're like, okay. So um, we go back, and I th- yeah, it must have just been one of those where he's like, you know, trying to be one of the boys, but he just didn't realise he wasn't talking to two of the boys. Yeah. So it backfired on him initially. Yeah. <laughs> so in his in his room, when you looked <laughs> opposite. He lived on one of those kind of estates where, like, the, he, there wasn't really a back garden. It was just like a co- communal alleyway, you know, the ones yeah. on. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So like, he lived. On, he lived on one of those gaffs. So when you look out of his bedroom window, opposite on the other end would be like someone's bathroom, right? Yeah. You can probably see where this is going now. Yeah. No. So. So. <laughs> <laughs> so Detail, please. He, he mentioned to us in passing, thinking that me and my friend in question would be like, "Oh yeah, let's see." That, um, mm. He'd noticed one of the houses opposite when the lady inhabiting it went for a wee, the glass wasn't frosted. So he could kind of, he could see everything that was happening. And the creepy How little... How high foot... up was that toilet? <laughs> <laughs> it was just because he, he could see him. It was the He's angle. Like she stands down. on the seat. It was the angle. She's got the toilet on it. face in the see, window. Could, like because like the angle he could see. Why is she hovering like that at home? <laughs> She's just got a leg up against yeah, the that's, window that's onto the glass. That's definitely a public toilet kind of activity. Yeah. Just with her back to him like, yeah. like what? Like, yeah. Trying to um, do trick shots with a piss. Yeah. Like, <laughs> creepy dude, dude, so what did he say? So he, so said he was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, when, when she goes to when she goes to the toilet, you can see it. If you look out the window, you can see it. I was like, what? He's like, yeah, well, you know, the other day she was having a piss and I got my phone out, you know, like, oh, I looked no. at my friend and we were like, did this cunt just say what we think we said? Was that your manager you said? <laughs> oh, my manager in my work. <laughs> Just, and bear in mind, he'd known me for like two weeks. And he's like, you want to see my neighbour piss? And he's telling me shit like that. <laughs> she doesn't know, but I know. I was, I, me, me, me and my mate were like, like, bro, you can't, you know that's illegal, like, you can't do that. Like, it's that's, dead illegal. That's about <laughs> as illegal as it's getting without crossing the line, yeah. you know. <laughs> my neighbour's got only fans, but she doesn't know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Um, I've actually installed a cup and a piece of string so I can hear a piss as well. 
Literally, 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 literally like three or four months later, this bloke had a missus and she was like pregnant. Uh, and I, I, yeah. I'm just like, dude, every time I'd see them together all like, You were just thinking like you filmed stuff, was, like, an Ava person. Yeah, I'm like, she has no idea what you've done. Could you imagine? Is he still yeah. living in the same do. flat? Yeah, it's horrible. <laughs> Could you imagine now though if the, your mate's not like, your old friend like, has not seen it, but the girl who pisses is listening in right now. <laughs> and she's yeah. just like, hang on a minute. I've seen him around yeah. before. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure I could see a guy across there with a view top on. <laughs> like a little, like dude, a sniper, my, my, like dude, flash like, from a real, window. Like it, <laughs> my head fell off. I was like, It's an understandable that, thing. Dude. You're not going to sit there and go, that, that, you know what? Can you send us the Blue piss? Blue was that you know, you, know, you, know, you, know, you know Joe? My mate Joe. You know, you know yeah, 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 yeah. He, he was who I went with and we, we looked at each other like, is this motherfucker serious? <laughs> like, <laughs> Can you just say what I think he said? <laughs> just dead odd. I like he said he got his phone out as if he was about to like show you. Like, oh, like get on no. to the street. <laughs> rather than put, I don't want to be part of this only, very elite. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah. I have to leave my planet. The fuck? Okay. So yeah, we've had some really good gigs. <laughs> <laughs> Steel House was great. <laughs> Steel House has been I awesome. Rockstock was boss twice. <laughs> Rockstock um, was Rockstock was awesome twice. Yeah, because we we got Steelhouse from Planet Rockstock the first time, and then yeah. when we got asked back to Rockstock the second year, we got asked to open the main stage because we like yeah, headlined like, the yeah, second stage good. the first time. And it was I remember going to um the guy who was bringing us on, and I was, he was like, oh, it's gonna be a good gig, you know, for the the way, opening yeah. up the main stage, and I was like, yeah, we're gonna get some mosh pits, he went you won't be getting mosh pits with this crowd. And I was like, bitch, fucking watch us. <laughs> and then he even said it on stage. Are he you was challenging like, me? Yeah. yeah. And he was even like, um, he just went, oh, uh, they want a mosh pit, but I don't think that you guys will be up for it. First fucking song in. Like, as soon as it opened up, and I was like, yes. English people don't like being threatened yeah. or whatever. They're like, what? We can't. Watch but it. we will then, yeah. dude. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, thank you for making them pit yeah. now. Cause... <laughs> Oh, fucking Courtney, right now. Like, Courtney does it from a spirit box. Like she'll play a song and she'll be like, uh, "Smacking the mic, dude." <laughs> oh, sorry. We're not doing ASMR. Like. Yeah, she completely deafened him. He got the yeah. headphones on. <laughs> <laughs> he thought a breakdown were kicking. Yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, right before they're about to play like Holy Roller or something, she'll be like, "Right, I didn't really want to say anything like to you guys because I felt really bad, but like you, you don't have to look tired. You know, you look you look a bit puffed out. You're, like you're not really got it in yet." So we're gonna play a little bit of a ballad now, and then they just kick into Holy Roller, and everyone nice. just like takes it as a threat. It's like, oh fuck you! It's I'm like, not tired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I didn't see you like, that live. She didn't, she didn't really say like you look tired or anything, but Holy Roller is probably the song that went off the most. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like when um, Ronnie Radke is about doing um, his song, and he goes, "This is the heaviest song we have ever fucking written," and he's like proper hyping them up, and then he just goes, "Met a girl and it really thought she liked me." <laughs> <laughs> it's, like <dead> body. <laughs> <laughs> it's such a good swan. Yeah. Yeah. So good. If you have a baby or a child, throw them in the fucking pit. <laughs> I'm going for it. Right. Uh, it's genius, absolute genius. Uh, <laughs> that's a, I need to go back to Planet Rock stuff again, though. That was like one of the first times we had like a big chant before we went on stage, yes. wasn't it? As well, it like, oh, turn me. And we were like, <laughs> this is fucking like weird. Yeah, yeah. weird. Was that to go and get the basses from downstairs while he was fucking gelling his hair. Or we were like, lad, we're meant to be playing now. Oh, did you not set it up? <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. That it was that, yeah, because the merch take cues and everything was sick for that, and we never had that before. Year. Yeah, that the first year, like the queue for the merch was the most we've ever had, yeah. and it blew our mind because we were just like, to, Haxon, you know, Haxon, mm. they, they actually had to help us shift merch. Yeah, they're they so ju- nice. We love together. We yeah. fucking love Haxon. Haxon. They're so yeah. lovely. Yeah, like the 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 yeah they jumped on and started helping us and stuff, and it was because we just didn't expect it. We were like, what the hell is going on? Like. It was awesome. That's when um the rumors started with uh, that gig as well. And when the, we we broke the floor. Yeah. So. Got everyone jumping to air to the floor, air to the throne, we've been and the f- cakes, dude. Yeah, so we were doing air to the throne, and we got the whole crowd jumping. And because it's like a raised dance floor, it was just bending a little bit. And then that became to oh, the floor was bending to oh, we well, heard the floor bent to we heard you broke the floor, and we were there going instead yeah. of going like no, 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 that's not true. We were like yeah. You yeah. broke the floor. Too right. Yeah, yeah, we did. And now <laughs> we're gonna died. break every yeah. venue around the country. Yeah. Ah. We're going around destroying it, <laughs> sledgehammers to the floor. Now and we leave and everything's perfectly fine. And, and we like tidy up after ourselves. <laughs> 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 
Go around digging seagulls. Barbecue sauce will over you. Put this through the till. <laughs> I think for me, the probably the, the biggest like gig highlight, uh, maybe the, yeah, probably the biggest, probably the reason I'm still in the band right now is probably what was before these guys joined. We oh to, yeah, okay. we went to probably we, don't we wish we went with you yeah. guys because we feel like yeah, we would. Yeah, no, yeah. we feel like we probably could have benefited <laughs> from it more. But it's the same for it me. If funny. I didn't do those gigs with Bullet, when we when our old singer like left and the old guitarist, I probably wouldn't have had like the oof. To let's carry on and try it because that was enough of a taste of something absolutely crazy. Because yeah. we did a really, 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 really <laughs> shit gig in like Leeds, like the like the week before we went to Russia. Yeah. Played two arena shows with Bullet. It was like Came five thousand people, then eight thousand people, then just the, us, and then Bullet. Like, no one else. it by coming home, and then a week after we got home, we played another really, really shit <laughs> gig to like no one. And it was so, just like, like without those two middle gigs in Russia. Uh, they're probably just not fucking bothered again, to be honest. Because yeah. we come over from that, and it was like, it was such a high. It did look good. Ever, to be fair. It was like this is just awful. Like it's horrible. Like there's a picture. There's a picture of us somewhere. Like obviously all all line up and everything, and it's just like a sea of people behind mm. us. And it wasn't just like a festival. Like you say, it was just us and then them. Obviously, they're all there for bullet. Mm. But because it was only us before, everyone wanted to see them and be at the front. Has all pushed down dead fast, so it was packed. Mm. I had the worst shits before those gigs ever because I was just like, "This is crazy." <laughs> I had like eight emodium before it, but once we done the first show, <laughs> eight, <laughs> and <laughs> packet. I know, yeah. Just I was like, packet <laughs> <laughs> bloated for fourteen <laughs> days. <laughs> I was fine the next day though when there was more people because I thought that was so many people. I'm not gonna tell the difference between that many people. And like the couple of thousand more, because yeah. that was still so many. So I actually felt all right the next day. That's fine. Yeah, because you had fucking as, yeah, I was 25 still riding on the, uh, the other ones. I bet you had a shit like, you know, months. Randy in South mm-hmm. Park, where he has the giant shit and he <laughs> just spirals upwards. But, you know, we, we, <laughs> hey, we, we turned up to those gigs. We were in our own little black like car because we had like a little chauffeur guy that had been organized. I mean, we paid for him. Like, but it was like, been yeah. organized. It was like the VIP treatment, like, they had all the buffets sorted. Like, we had a buffet with, like, Jason Bold from Bullet, and he's so nice. And I, I don't know if I was, like, looking him up on Wikipedia, because I listen to music, but I don't necessarily look at the bands. Like, I know it's terrible because I'm in one, but you don't... Wow. If you listen, you just listen, don't you? And, like, he doesn't even know our names. You're not, the, fu- you're not the singer. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But it's, it, it, no, but it's, it's like, where you can always tell if people are an actual fan of a band if they can name the bass player. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. they're bugging you, aren't they? No, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> no it's Roland. Yeah. But we're going to do one of those TikToks, guess who's the bass player, and then everyone guess in the comments and they're all just wrong. So <laughs> well, We did that and then they were like, ordered us pizzas, we had proper little... I don't know, it was just, everyone was like looked after and it was really like... It was Literally. proper. It we had, was we had like proper. two days of like, this is what it could be like if you do it for long enough yeah. and get a bit lucky. <clears throat> But if genuinely, if I hadn't had those two gigs, I'd have fu- well fucked this up. <laughs> well, let's let's hope they'll have us again. Hey, bullet. Not even to do. <laughs> well, well, like, to bullet. be fair, apparently Matt Look did us. say like something about because shit, you, you kind of got fucked well, up not, a little bit. Didn't yeah, you? but it wasn't anything to do with them. Yeah, so no, it wasn't anything to do with them. We won't guess information it on a podcast. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> just that, like, well, <laughs> two show. Bookers, have us again. <laughs> this is this is to bullet. Hey, bookers, yeah, we'll man. open up. We'll do a dead good set for you. Now Padge messages Jess, messages Jess and goes, Merry Christmas. Never, so never ever, ever will you ever <laughs> fucking no, do that again. I've got him on Facebook. He's so funny. He's really nice, Padge. And he said, I'm lovely, I am. And that was before he was drunk. So I was like, That was actually truth. super racist, that. No, it wasn't. Yeah. That's exactly yeah. what he said. Sounded, that Indian accent. Yeah, you sound a bit Indian. That's what it sounds like. And he's dead nice. He said, you're really lovely. I messaged him. Oh, <laughs> I, I messaged him at Christmas and um, before like the new EP come out and I was like we're sending like promo copies out to like important special people and that like if you've got time to listen to it feel free if you don't blah 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 just a plate nothing official and that was like December and then he got back to me like last week and was like Merry Christmas Jess like I'm so sorry I missed your message <laughs> I was like Merry Christmas I was like <laughs> but it was so funny. Was, he said he really future. liked it. He said he really liked all the music though, which was good. good. He was like, "You've got something." So very buckles. <laughs> but it was just really funny the fact he like started it with "Merry Christmas" back. I thought it was dead June. sweet. Yeah. Oh, it was. It, yeah, bless him. Well, They're really funny, nice. Funny guys. Yeah, nice guy. Well, yeah. If you like the EP, 
fuck us. If you're dead and that's good. to anyone. That's not just yeah. him. <laughs> well, Jared from Bowling for Soup, he fucking loves us. He, he was said like, really he, can, uh, he can see our stuff at download. He was like, this needs yeah. to be a download right now. So download. Was that another? Us. Bloodstock, fuck us. Everyone. Real. Don't fuck us. <laughs> <laughs> Ever again. <laughs> Real fall into the sea. <laughs> oh. New Atlantis. Yeah. But yeah, book us, all of yous. I want, I want, he's, I want. he's saying it like I've got all these like celebrity bands and stuff subscribed with. <laughs> we'll, we'll clip it for TikTok yeah. and then just tag them. <laughs> tag them yeah. in it. <laughs> Good tactic. We'll do yeah. that. We'll, we'll, we'll do that. We'll, we'll, do, some, we'll, we'll do that we'll, as well. We'll, do some serious bonfire pissing on it. Yeah, that hand fart then. No. Because <laughs> 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 Joe's do it, mic with his hand. <laughs> do it closer to the microphone for a TikTok. <laughs> I can't, I can't do, that. do that. No, I just oh, all at the same time, the time like huh? monkey see. I don't monkey think do. I can Wait. do that. Yeah. Libby's really lit the name, by the way. That's just clapping. That sounds like Eey, why is it making a block noise? So... <laughs> mayo noises. <laughs> wait, wait. What mayo do you have? Where it just goes to the... Vegan I don't. mayo. I don't. I don't have you've got to be grateful that other side of the room, you've not got headphones on. Wow. Oh. <laughs> I, can't, I can't get the... Wait. Sound? It literally sounds like someone having a really horrible time. <laughs> <laughs> Like a really horrible time. <laughs> that was that's I'm it, not that's staying with Uncle Jerry again. <laughs> I was like, in the beginning, because when you said we'd be muted, I was like, it's a good job we'd be muted. Because when you were playing it, obviously I don't have any headphones on. So everyone was just going. <laughs> <laughs> and they're laughing down the mic, but like whispering. It's like, what's going on? It's because they can't hear themselves. So it's, you, you make weird noises when yeah. you can't hear yourself. Oh. <laughs> that's a good job. It's the same with like, a, like when you're recording, because obviously when you're recording like music, you go into the booth and it's all completely like isolated sound. And you hear like every little fucking ingestion and you, oh god, yeah. you can hear your brain, you can hear your brain thinking in there. And you're like, oh, this is horrible. This I need to put the fucking track on. Like, get me out. It's like people go in them rooms, you know, like the you know the mind yeah, decibels yeah. rooms. rooms. They can yeah. hear their own blood flowing and stuff. Well, I, I want to try one of them I'd rooms. Like to try oh, them, they're like quietest rooms in the yeah, world. Yeah, yeah, I really want to try them. Jake that. sends me sometimes when I'm recording vocal takes, he'll send me little compilations of the sounds I make between <laughs> vocal lines, which I never knew that I did. <laughs> because I'm, and, and I'm, I make this little like weird spitty noise and then like a sharp intake of breath. And then when I finish a line, and I'm, I think I've just done a dead stop, I go, hmm. <laughs> 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 we'll fix this date on the then you the tracks. He just isolates them all. Yeah, it's what? Tiny temper. <laughs> yeah. Do you know tiny temperature written in the stars? There's a, there's, yeah, yeah. There's, there's, a, there's like a, an isolated vocal of that. Um, literally every line in the song is like, even written in, in the stars. <laughs> Him, like, <laughs> like, Breakdown. Like he's got There's one single China. Listen, listen to the song. I think it's just the regular version. Just listen to the regular song. That whole you first bit. It loud. It's, it's actually really off putting. Once you've tuned it. into it, it's like his lungs are the size of fucking balls. Muse like, give it. He's got, no, he's got oh, no yeah, Matt Bellamy. Matt Bellamy is every, so uh, bad for it. Every, every like five seconds, he's like, <gasps> yeah. <It's> like, <laughs> The worst is. The worst he's watching Scream it. while he's recording. He's feeling good. Have you heard his version of Feeling yeah. Good? Like it's just like. Yeah. Birds flying high. You know how I feel. Sun in the sky. It's like, why did they just clip it out? Also, a bit like, I don't, they're all see, laughing. They're like, should we be calling an ambulance? Yeah. <laughs> That's what Kyle sounds like when they put the fog on in the venue. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone thinks I'm doing dirty gutter rolls. I'm not. I'm just struggling to stay alive. It's actually a smooth jazz singer. <laughs> That's what he sounds like when he's trying to whack to a Battenberg in his services. I wasn't the one who did it. It was in the Airbnb. In the Airbnb, the monster, a full Battenberg. Like, yeah, it's like a subway. He literally just, just went... <laughs> We were great. We were in an Airbnb. We didn't have any cutlery, <laughs> and I was like proper urgent for Battenberg, <laughs> which is not and a thing. I That's too. not a thing. Yeah, cause, no, because Battenberg is god tier. God tier. No, it's scratch. not. It's yeah, it old is. people. 
No, but it's not. Uh, it's, like one, it's like one wrong up from where there's... Put it this way, like, <laughs> Kyle's, like, tall culinary habits, Jaffa cakes and our big vocal zones. Yeah. Right, no, I haven't had Jaffa cakes. <laughs> you know, like, all the things you're not supposed to have as a singer when you're touring, he just has them all and he won't After the show! Right, I won't yeah, have but, but, but it's the fog like, that's fucking him up. Yeah. 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 Not, the, not the Mars bar milkshake or the Jaffa cakes or yeah. the full That completely milk. absorb all the moisture in your body <laughs> no. the moment they touch it. After the <laughs> show, <laughs> I will be You have them before the show as well. You have them the way to the gig. If we're like nine hours, like, oh, we're not on until like half ten and it's like eight in the morning. Yeah, I might have no, yourself a little. So like, you know you have a really hot yeah. curry and you're fucking, your fucking shit is painful as fuck the next I don't day. Like it's like, curry. but I ate it yesterday. <laughs> it's like, it has an after effect. Yeah, it's like, not that fucking long. <laughs> oh, bro. Well, yeah, okay. it's only going from here to here. So <laughs> it was after a show. We, by the way, we didn't even have any more shows after that. It was the last show, and I was like, I'm having a bad. It was day. like this fuck hasn't it. happened once. This was, happens at every gig. I was having a. I, I've only. I haven't had bad burger in ages. <laughs> I, didn't, I, meant, I didn't mean specifically bad burger. I meant like just bad. It's stuff everything else as well. I've gone cold turkey. <laughs> Sat in tweet just once. I need me Battenbergs. He's <laughs> sitting there like no shirt. Sat there on the sexual like... services to Mr. Kipling. He said they have BET. 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 He said they just Turkey and. He's yeah. like, I'm not a Battenberg. It's so long. So yeah, I just had a Battenberg, but where we went, we didn't have any cutlery or anything, so we just had to have it whole. He raw dogged it, throat. Yeah. He only bit it like three times as well, so there was like half bitten Battenberg. <laughs> I'm not have it in one. It was like this big. I'm not just gonna like gob it Mr. all in Kipling one. Mr. Kipling turned in his grave. Turned in his grave. Fucking... I don't. Is he even real? I don't know. <laughs> no, like, like at best he's not real. <laughs> I bet she's not real, so like father. She's Christmas. in the freezer. Um, um, Someone Google if Mr. Real. Kipling's a real dude. Like, please. Cause I'm pretty sure he. <laughs> I, think he I don't think he was. But, like, Aunt Bessie's not real. <coughs> Fact check. I don't think Uncle Ben's Ben. real. No, no, Uncle either. Ben was real. Aunt Jemima wasn't, but Uncle Ben is. Oh, uh, okay. Or was. But yeah, Aunt Bessie wasn't real. And neither was Mr. Kipling. <laughs> No, I'm just saying, like, What's going on? Not real. I'm not buying Yorkshire it. Pudding. It's not. Yeah, yeah. It's not a real brand. Do you brand. know who Aunt Bessie is? I just want to make Yorkshire puddings in it. Just don't. Yorkshire puddings. He's not bastard. real. Mr. Kipling's not real. Apparently, is he not? He never existed. He was a fictional character. Oh, God. Mm. Mr. Really? Kipling's not real. That's why marketers who are looking to give a traditional family environment. Oh, oh, that's, oh, yeah. dude. Oh, oh, my life is a lie. Know, yeah, yeah. You know the Mr. Kipling Viennese worlds? Mm. I, when I went to Vienna, I was like... I Did you used to do the topping? <laughs> 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 that's why it's got the jamming, because it was originally blood. <laughs> so, no, I was like... When, when I was like in the Take That tribute, I was like, oh, we're going to Vienna. We were doing a show in Vienna. And I was like, oh, I can't wait to have an actual Viennese world from Vienna. Oh my god. And I went everywhere looking for one. Learned the hard way that they originated by Mr. Kipling and it's a British thing and I was dead sad. I'd be like, oh, I've been having <laughs> traditional Viennese worlds this entire time and I was just dead sad. I was like Well, I've learned something new. There. I didn't know. Don't that. go Vienna if you want a Viennese world. Like yes. going to you're gonna be like no, because no, because the, the importing have... Mr. Kipling. No, because it doesn't. You don't have the word French in before no, that's burrito. True. Yeah, that's true. Like you're gonna have true. Viennese world. It's yeah. I was expecting one in Vienna. How many people have called them Vietnamese worlds? I don't know. I've Google. never heard anyone <laughs> called it a Vietnamese world. Have you got any of them Vietnamese worlds? I've actually heard them You have to pick them from the trees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Once Vietnamese worlds. Right now, I've never heard Vietnamese worlds. Right now, is that what you're going to say? Yeah, yeah. Oh, really? I thought you were being so. Have you ever heard anyone say Vietnamese worlds? Have you ever heard anyone say Vietnamese worlds? Not so much in 10 seconds. Someone's got to have said that. One really thing that's really fun about world. Joe is he doesn't understand sarcasm. <laughs> and he, yeah, he, he, actually, he told us this when he when he first like joined the band. He, he comes like how a, has he survived this long? I know. He, come, he comes like an audition. <laughs> comes like an audition, and he, he mentioned it in passing at some point, and he was like, "Oh yeah, that's, I don't get sarcasm. I don't know why." And I was like, "Oh, do you not really? You don't get sarcasm." And, and now like, from a weak point, and he was like, he was like. No, no, I don't. It's just ever since I was a kid, really. And I, just like, yeah. I was like, oh, you, you really don't get it. I was That's like, so <laughs> weird. And he was like, nah, I mean, I, I, I couldn't tell you why. I don't, he just kept acting like, and I was like, 
No, I fucking messed and he was like, no. Oh. He also <laughs> told us he was vegan on that first day. He was like, you know, Standard. it's not a big deal. As soon as he said it, he was like, fucking hell, stop going on about it. And he said it once. <laughs> <laughs> and he actually said it, like, yeah. not sheepishly, <laughs> but it was almost like... If... Mom, Dad, sit yeah. down. Was like, <laughs> I'm vegan. Was like, I need to I'm talk to you. I've got something to tell you. Oh. I'm a vegan. <gasps> <laughs> and a keyboard player. <laughs> Joe came first. Wait until I'm best years about this. <laughs> Joe came first and then helped choose Kyle as well. He also and, auditioned. And Kyle. <laughs> 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 this acting from the bakery. <laughs> Yeah. I, so, was, yeah. Yeah. I was a butcher. This is time. a sitcom, isn't yeah. it? The unlikely friends. Yeah. <laughs> the just, old couple. Just sat there going, my mortal nemesis. Yeah. <laughs> Animal rights activists. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, but it was funny. You're not anymore. Yeah, I'm no longer uh, a butcher. <laughs> I, I am still vegan. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm no longer a butcher. No, you're not. No. You're not. <laughs> See how we've had some good gigs, like. Yeah. <laughs> so we finished the hellos. <laughs> <laughs> and we kind of like it. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. Sometimes. It's dead fun. <laughs> well, I'm not going to have you sweating in here too much longer, so uh, we'll go upstairs in a bit. But um, what we should do whoa, is... Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> we've had two sides so we'll, now. So we'll... Uh, I, I don't know if you've checked out in the previous episodes, but I like to end it on giving yourself some advice if you were well to your younger self basically so where where are we uh, where do you want to go first who wants to take that um advice yeah do what you know. love and don't take other people's opinions too seriously especially if they're no beds i'll use the more polite word don't know choose yeah, not choose don't... your friends wise because that sounds like cutting people out but like do don't, what you want to oh, do and do don't let people hold you back, especially if you're super duper passionate about it. Yeah. I've never been held back, so I'm lucky, so that's why I'm just saying I would do it. If you've got people who can support you, even better, but if you don't... Fuck them. You know, yeah. <laughs> we're, only, we're only here once, so give it a good old go, because yeah. you don't want to get older and regret you didn't try it. If you've tried it and it's failed, it's fine you've tried it, and if you try it and it works, you've succeeded. So yeah. there's yeah. no bad I heard a way. quote, and it was like, it was it was pretty good. It was like, um, you can you can try and put all your eggs in the basket and, you know, go ham on something that you fucking hate and still have every chance at failing. So you might as well fail at something you enjoy. Yeah. Or not. Yeah. Than... Oh, yeah. Or succeed. Oh, yeah. But there's also the advice of, uh, well, the motivational quote I heard was... Um, Every single person who is dead on Mount Everest was highly motivated to maybe calm it down a little bit. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was George Carlin that said something about that these like these highly motivated people are dangerous. You know, he's talking about like politicians and business owners, yeah. landowners, and stuff like that. He says, he says, you, you show me somebody that's just smoking weed and eating Doritos, <laughs> watching cable, sat in his pants, and I'll show you somebody that's keeping out of trouble. So. Yeah. <laughs> True. I'd say advice wise, yeah, just don't give up. Carrot, like, crack on and wrap it before you tap it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Pop turns. Pop turns. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah, yeah, just like, like again, like yeah. If people, so... when you get people like, when are you gonna get a proper job? And you're like, it is a proper job. Shut the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> Ignore them, knobheads. I've got that a lot. No, advice. Don't leave a job until you've got another job lined up. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Do that. <laughs> um, Don't eat yellow. You snow. can't spell can without can, for starters. That's true. So mm. all of y'all need to listen to their shit. And, um, <laughs> yeah, always. <laughs> supposed to, like, never say smell never. Weed every Practice day, more. Smell <laughs> no weed every day. You're doing some accents there. Yeah. <laughs> So, uh, and let's not end it badly. The, the go, the go, <laughs> I'm a bit shaky. Cutting a huge part and then leaving well, but, the episode. Yeah, no, me, um, and yeah, practice more. To be honest, you can always practice more. You know, you never, you're never good enough to not be better. So there's always enough yeah. time in the day. 
There's 24 for hours in the day for guitar. <laughs> for guitar. <laughs> we all got the same 24 hours in the day. Yeah. Uh, I don't, I don't know, like, you know, I always think, like, it, it, do whatever you're passionate about is a pretty big indicator that that's where your, yeah. your cards lie, and, you know, you, it's kind of up to you to figure out how to make that a thing, but mm-hmm. that's kind of the universe telling you that's your thing, so figure it out, you know? And don't let people um, be horrible to you. And, yeah, yeah, don't follow... Well, you can punch... Well, you can yeah. <laughs> don't We're like... not advocating violence or whatever. Yeah. Don't... Unless they start that's it. That's the I'm trying to fight. Finish it. Don't compare yourself to other people as well. That's one, like mm. that's one. Of, like I'll be like I I do it even now. I'm like I'll see people like smashing it, and I was like it's amazing. But I'm like oh, I want to do that. Yeah. Mm. But then it's like no, it's and then I forget like because like we we like we want to play download and stuff, and then we're like oh why haven't we played download yet? And then we're like hang on, we've had, we've been going five years this year, mm. and what two and a bit of that was locked down. So it's like you know what? So we uh, sometimes forget. And I'm like you know what? we've done a hell of a lot in that time. In the realistically three years that we've yeah. been allowed to do anything, at least. We've done yeah. a hell of a lot. Yeah. Even for five years, it's like we've done a hell of a lot, but it is it is easy to try, to go, like, you see people, like, getting on, like, massive tours and massive bills, and you'll be sat there, and you forget that they've been doing it for, like, ten plus years, and you'll be yeah. like, oh, why aren't we doing that? And the that? people who do just go to the top, it's, that's usually a whim. That's not something that everyone does, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, that's, not the, that's not the norm. And... The way I the way I see it now is if we've made one person happy, we are a fully successful band, yeah. and we've done that. We have people say to us, saying, "Ah, oh, you know, we've um, like, I oh, know we love your music. It makes me dead happy and stuff like that." And then when you see all the people, like, what are you saying? You know, you know, you know, it's you know, you're doing like your job right as a band when people come up to you with <clears throat> tattoos of your band logo yeah. or. Whatever it may be. Tell, telling us that they cried during our set because it made them so emotional, not because yeah. it was dead bad. <laughs> <laughs> like, stuff, stuff like that, you know. Yeah. You, 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 you can be... There's, there's bands playing to thousands of people and selling all sorts of records who still don't really have that many people going and getting shit inked on them that's got any relevance mm. to them at all. It is and, you know, blowing, like, we, yeah. we have people quite regularly, you know... Oh, I'm thinking. Can you sign here? I'm like, don't you know? But um, I get the idea of people inking your logo of something you do on their skin. And it's, it's permanent. That's, you know, yeah. You, yeah. You know that that's buying a t-shirt. That's one crazy. Thing, but like a tattoo, like it's not coming off. Like the yeah. hot dog girl. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Someone's actually now. got her tattooed on their thigh. Oh, fucking hell! Lara. I saw it. That and better be like, a bet, lad. Wow. He lost a bet. He lost a big bet. He probably just thought, it was a good tattoo, like. He probably, yeah. just, he probably just thought, fuck it. <laughs> fuck to it. That's why I've grown a mongers crewmate on my <laughs> leg. Too, yeah. And thought, I've got this because of, a, fuck because of a... Because of a, like, a bet, basically. And I've got <laughs> a frog in <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so for this one, we, made, we went skating and she was... Um, too scared to go down the big ramp. And I was like, if you go down the big ramp, she's tattooed. So I was like, if you go down the big ramp, you can tattoo me, do me first tattoo. And she just went, and I was like, fuck. <laughs> she was Man of me word. She died, she got he got someone else to do a she tattoo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just lost the paramedic, do us a quick favour. <laughs> yeah. Sc- scrolling DNR with a fork <laughs> onto her chest. Oh, fucking hell, guys. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> better leave it then. What was it? Was it like a f- yeah. advice to your former self Wait, or your future self? No, to your nice former to, self. Be nice to everyone, but don't let them walk over you. Yeah, stay humble, but don't be a. My advice would be that they probably don't fucking bother. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> just, just play Destiny. Get more hours in. <laughs> grind, grind, oh, grind, grind lads. Sigma grind. <laughs> <set. laughs> don't, uh, don't you dare. Fuck, like, get out of that chair. So just keep gaming. <laughs> keep like, gaming. I'm, I'm Esports will be a real thing. <laughs> Don't put a flashlight in a dishwasher. <laughs> <laughs> Have we established what that's called then, the big thing? It's, it's, it's just it's a, just it's a, just a, a, like a fuck like torso. A well, so. well, well <laughs> a what? the guy we a knew. Fuck torso. <laughs> the guy oh, we knew. advice. Keywords on Google. <laughs> it's a sexy, <laughs> sexy pillow. I just, Nine kilogram <laughs> Sexy <whore>. pillow. Nine <laughs> sexy <laughs> pillow. <laughs> yeah. I just call it the missus. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> One more advice as well. Don't film people while they're pissing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> don't film people yeah. while they're pissing for real. That's actually good advice, though. Yeah. Don't do that. <laughs> Even better yeah. advice, if you should choose to film pissing, don't, don't show your fucking mate to your phone for two fucking weeks. <laughs> <laughs> because Get, they're just gonna carry up. some consent forms with you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Excuse me, just knocking on the window, going, can you sign this? But they're and just like, <laughs> <swat her. laughs> turning up in a, in a, a pretend uh, DPD fan. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you just sign for this, please. Why are you fucking reading it? Just <laughs> give us a squiggle. I seen that it was like Scarlett Johansson signing something, looking confused. It was like, a marriage a marriage like yeah. <laughs> confused and why she's signing a marriage certificate <laughs> thing. <laughs> Just fucking get it done. <laughs> Just get it signed. But we've had some good works. kicks. You've had some good kicks. <laughs> I steal those out of the way. So what have we got coming up? You've got uh, you got Made of Stone. Uh, yeah. You've got Nozfest. We've got Sharkfest. Sharkfest. Yes. We've got, got, Shark Fest. Shark Fest yes. we've we've got, got Leo's at the end of the year yeah, as well. Yes, headline, headline show. <laughs> we've just announced, is it the, was it the South End on Sea one? Yes. In September. And there's an announcement tomorrow, but obviously this will probably be out after that so yeah, yeah. there is an announcement out now as you can say now don't I know, yeah. when's it going to be is it going to be out after tomorrow, tomorrow or? it might be uh, it'd be you know, probably in about a week yeah, yeah in a week oh, I mean. so, we, we so yeah we're, we're playing two gigs with Stone Broken yeah. um, mm. in <laughs> July Yes, it, it, during the same during the Made of Stone weekend oh, yeah. so we're playing on the Friday and the Sunday so it's the 19th mm. The 19th is Stone Broken 20th Made of Stone and then the 21st is Stone, Stone Broken and they're all down south yeah but, uh, but it'll already be announced by now, so by the time yeah. it comes into air, so... And then... Don't worry, I'll, I'll check with you for announcement day. So yeah. Yeah. We, it's getting announced tomorrow, so... Yeah. Oh, is oh, it tomorrow, all... like, tea time? It's like 5pm tomorrow. So uh, yeah, tomorrow else. at 5. Else. Um, there's another one... Oh, no, I don't know. I don't know. We're in a weird stage. We've had quite a few offers at the moment, but I'm not sure where the confirmation is. Like yeah. on like the final. Yeah. yeah. You'll find out. We'll tell you. If you look at our Facebook page and Instagram, we post our dates there. You're right. <laughs> We've just been endorsed as well by yeah. sexypillows.com. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's a big one for me personally. I've been a long time user. <laughs> it's just, they've just molded that just Paddy's like... bussy. <laughs> I've got, a, I've got a signature. Why are we doing this? Like, <laughs> like, 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 it's actually got a Hot cool. It's actually got a inside. cool little like. It's got a cool little release underneath, so the cleanup's way easier. Because of it's my like struggles, wet, like, like changing engine oil. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's got a drip so tray. It's got a tray. Yeah, and just. <laughs> Use that for the for the fucking Balls blazed buns after. You could have a, a little like one. woody pull string so it's got <laughs> phrases on it. I saw a picture of. Why one. is it so stiff? <laughs> and it was a foot, but with a vagina where the ankle was. A foot what? vagina. It was just a foot. It was like, like a flashlight. Like a flashlight, but like a shaped like a foot. Did you just a vajankel? Yeah, well, that's some kind of like host, uh, hostel type stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Hostel, there, who, I'm not being funny, but who looks at a foot and goes, you know what? I'd stick my dick in the tip of that. <laughs> <laughs> Who's gonna do that? No one's just gonna. Where's oh, the, give me that. The give me that. The next, the, next year's ringtone. <laughs> it was like to be put up there. It was that way. The vajankos. Who would want to fuck a foot? It was like, the ankle. Like, like, I want to stick my dick inside the tip of that ankle hole. So we've got Ash and Reach. Holy fuck! Oh. Holy, holy fuck! <laughs> holy fuck! <laughs> Um, Foot in hell. <laughs> Foot me. Foot me. Uh, see, so we've had some good gigs. And <laughs> <laughs> uh, on that bombshell. Yeah, it's it's like you know when you go to a party and it's like you you know you've got to leave in like twenty minutes, so you've got to start saying the goodbyes now. Yeah. Yeah. Like, or you just 
piss off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I thought, I'll get my final question in <laughs> early on. Yeah, yeah. I've so, I've so, it was I two know. hours ago. Yeah. I don't, I don't, want, I don't want birds tweeting picked up on microphones. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Sat there and shit, I started work three I'll be a hours puzzle ago. on the couch in a second. <laughs> it's, it's given how no. this has gone, it's ironic that I've, I've become a fan in my older age of the latter, where I just don't, I just fuck off now and just say bye <laughs> on the text. Like, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. I, had to, I had to run. Yeah, we had, it's easy, well. isn't it? Just it's just send just a, like, send yeah, a message. So we had to shoot off. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We've been here 10 minutes. <laughs> As they're even face-to-face talk to you, just go... I always just go, I'm really sorry, I need a wee. So it's been nice, <laughs> nice seeing you. Because what can they do then? No, stay. I've got to go to the toilet. And then you just like double down. Just oh, you can just... No. And then you just, see, then you just see a phone through or the window. Or if it's a blue... <laughs> 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 Hey, it, oh, fucking hey, with flashlight you just when you your period and then no, I'm, just gonna, I'm, I'm just going to the toilet. <laughs> just need to drain this drip tray. No. <laughs> <laughs> gotta, 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 gotta give the missus an MOT. <laughs> <laughs> if you turn up to a party with it, there's an actual date. Oh my god. <laughs> We're about to eventually quit then. Oh, <laughs> Make it talk. Make it blow bubbles. We said it's same, oh, same no. skin, isn't it? Oh, like the tip of a mouth crab. <laughs> oh, no. oh, you didn't need to elaborate. <laughs> uh, you're disgusting. <laughs> so what's been the worst thing said all night for for viewers? Not for us. Don't Don't recap. Post in the comments below. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and what what made you turn this yeah. off? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And if you've watched this, bullet buckles. Oh no, my yeah. god! Anyone? Yeah. I know, yeah. Um, are we gonna get some Ash and Reach fucking no no no, no. <laughs> no me. <laughs> <laughs> What makes them Ash and Reach? I'll be honest. (laughs) Probably not. What what would make them Ash and Reach ones? Just a logo logo stamped on the middle. Bone coming on the tramp stamp on the bottom. But coming spelt C U M. (laughs) Bone coming. Bone coming. Oh. This bit's gone. This bit. This this bit didn't yeah, happen. We are delirious. (laughs) It's the heat. It really really is is the heat. Yeah, it's it's toasty, isn't it? But anyway. It's uh, it's been nice. It's yeah, been good. Been nice I've enjoyed it. Thank you, I've, uh, thank you for having I've us. I've not really had to be involved, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> I feel I feel a bit bad that it's got my name on it because <laughs> <laughs> I've not really done anything. It's the only. It's, it's the fucking drag of credibility. Please keep it there. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. But no, thank you for uh, venturing across. I know, I'm, I'm not. Oh, so it's been really fun. Thank thank you for we'll, we'll do it again if it's not. If the you end want, of the podcast if you want us to, yeah, yeah. yeah. If our career is no yeah. longer over. Yeah, if they've not closed down my YouTube and Spotify, <laughs> we'll, yeah. uh, all sorts of things. And we'll, uh, we, we got, we, we talked about we need to, we probably we, do some bits on the road together yeah. at some yeah. point. Yeah, yeah. they were awesome. that were good fun. And this is uh, that'd be like the funniest fucking tour ever, dude. For that'd be fucking. because we have a. Uh, they, not not a lot of people know, but we have a little group chat, don't we, between <laughs> our, our, our band oh, yes. and, <laughs> and your band. Yeah. And there's a lot of memes that get posted in there <laughs> <laughs> that we can't put on our own profile. No. <laughs> I, 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 I posted a meme in there the other day, and I can't, I can't remember what the it level was. Like it was like a wholesome meme. I think, meme it, I think it was like a bit of a, it was more on the boomer and the things. And then Chris just goes, "Stop being a fucking pussy." <laughs> <laughs> Post a real fucking meme. So I was like, okay, into the vault we go. <laughs> Is that that guy behind a tree in a yellow tree? <laughs> Salt it's like me in the meme. Okay, fuck it. Yeah. It's time. Yeah. <laughs> Opens natural disasters. Uh, I, I, I posted something just fucking horrendous and it just goes, Nitro button. That's better. <laughs> Oh God, this is just a video of a woman having a piss. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's better. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> you've you've hacked you've hacked my phone. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> to our socials. A, a video of Chris having a piss. <laughs> <laughs> hey, have, have that, you cunts. <laughs> <laughs> you should have just sent that video that we put right at the very beginning of Chris in Edinburgh. I oh, know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what did it? Th- feel the burn. Yeah, feel the burn. <laughs> Oh, so funny. Honestly, no, I don't think that'll ever be top. <laughs> go, go to the internet. It was I like, know. it was like, you know, when you see porn parody, that was like a Jurassic Park <laughs> porn parody. Was it a skinwalker? <laughs> yeah, oh, cri- 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 cryptid porn. <laughs> <laughs> Appalachian fucking. Oh, oh dear. Lord. It, was, it was special. That's um. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on that bombshell. <laughs> do it, can you do it? Britain's Got Talents in, in that voice. Which one? And on that bombshell. Yeah, that'll do. <clears throat> I'm on that bombshell. <laughs> You've been uh, listening to Ash and Reach. Sorry. <laughs> Not the music. <laughs> <laughs> oh, on the Matt Black podcast. Thanks so much for coming in. Thank, Thank you so much. I'll see you soon. Thank you. Bye. See you later.